I'm so ready to go on a date with Graha. The, stop, stop head petting me. Stop head petting me. I'm not there. Hello? Why you, Why do you always do this? Huh? Why, why do you always do this to me? Huh? Um, <laughs> hello everyone. Hi. Um, we're, we're doing main side quest today. Yay. Uh, Want to see something really cool? I can show you something really, really cool. Look. <gasps> the lizard is back. <gasps> Hello! Um, also, let me move myself again. Once again, I'm too tall. I'm too big. I'm too, uh, I'm, uh, I'm, I'm too, there's too much of me. Um, hello everyone! I hope you guys are doing well. Let me, blah, 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 blah. let me, um, let me do this. Let me, let me, let me make the music a little more quiet. Um, yeah! Hello everyone! I hope you guys are doing well. Uh, I'm doing very, very well because I can look at my lizard again. Yay! Uh, and uh, I um, I don't know what I did to the hair, but this is what we're dealing with today. Uh, so yeah, and uh, this is gonna be my outfit for today. Yay! <laughs> I'm so happy. I did like I I think I made like five glams uh, when I got her back, uh, and uh, so yeah, uh, I'm really happy. <laughs> I'm not a laugh anymore. Woo! Uh, and again, don't get me don't get me wrong. Lalas are la lalas are lalas are cute. Lalas are amazing, but. Uh, not as a main, not as a main. Anyway, let me say hello to everyone who's here. Uh, hello Yumi, hello Zar, hello Blaze, hello Ihan, uh, hello me, hello Ikusa, uh, hello Yumi. No, I said hi to you, didn't I? Yes. Uh, hello Pandas, hello Mats, hello everyone, and everyone else who's here. Uh, welcome in, welcome in. Um, and Blackfire, hello, 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 hello. I hope you guys are doing well. Uh, the weekend is starting. Uh, I hope you had a good Friday. Um, we, I have so much to. Do. Well, no, I did. I d uh, there's a lot going on. Is that is all? There's a lot going on. <laughs> so uh, I, the weekend is gonna be interesting. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys are having a, a good a good time. Uh, most of the sound alerts are turned off. Well, all of them are turned off today. Uh, I did leave you with text to speech because we get some nice messages there sometimes. But if it gets excessive, obviously I will be, I will be taking that away uh, because we're doing main story quest and usually I don't have anything on during main story quest. But we're gonna keep it for today and see how it goes. So don't abuse it or I have to take your toys away from you, okay? Um, <laughs> Uh, but yeah, um, I don't know what awaits me. I thankfully did not get spo spoiled, spoiled, uh, for anything regarding 6.1. Um, so we're gonna go in there and it's, uh, it's gonna be great. And I, we're gonna see, um, yeah. Lala's Lala cute, Lizard is best. Lizard is a, a aura master race, excuse me. Like, look at it. She's so she's so beautiful, and I need to like catch up on uh, two weeks of not taking G poses, uh, because I if you if you didn't know if you're not aware yet, I'm a G pose addict. I'm a G pose main, and uh, so I have I I have been uh, it has been taken away from me for too long. I couldn't G pose as a Lala. It just doesn't work. I mean I can take cute screenshots, but not like the cool ones that I usually want to take. <laughs> So that was a pain. I have been nerfed and then again, I made a bunch of glams today and uh, I I don't know It's just I have to I have to get back into the flow of you know taking G poses and, and being happy and <laughs> And and you know getting used to the emotes again because I'm used to Lala emotes now Which by the way, I think Lala Lala fell emotes are like the best like they, they have the best emotes <laughs> it's just like they have such good emotes i i really like the the spin with the play dead and then the the pick me up thing that i that i kept doing to people uh let me just do this uh, i'm still a party with some nerds don't mind that though uh i'm gonna leave that in a second let me just do this 
and then take this away from you. <gasps> um, and then we have nice uh, rising stones. No, waking sands. No, what is it? Music? One of those. One of those. All of the above. Um, let me just apply that. I think it might be a little quiet. You tell me. It's probably fine. It's probably fine. Um, um, I didn't notice there's a best verb emote. Yes, there is. We have uh, cute Final Fantasy related emotes. Yes, 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 yes. Uh, they're amazing. If you're ever interested in any artists or anything, um, go below in my about section and there's like a credits panel and you can check out all the artists for all the things that I have. Every single acid, every like my model, my emotes, everything is down below. If you're ever interested, please go check them out because that is how the stream is possible with those, you know, with those people. I do nothing. I just sit here and I talk to you and the artists do all the things. <laughs> but yeah, um... She's looking at, like, you, uh, 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 no, why you big now? Oh, you mean Totaro? Yeah. Yeah, that is true. She is, uh, she is like, why are you so tall? What happened? I, I could, I could have sworn I saw you being small. Uh, and yeah, that is, uh, that was a fever dream. The last two weeks were a fever dream, but a nice one. Also, hello, Yuffie. What are you typing, Yuffie? Are you okay? <laughs> are you okay? Um... Um, hello MBG, how are you? What is this, an aura? Indeed, I'm back to aura, finally. Have you ever, MBG, have you ever seen me? Have you seen me as an aura? I don't know when you got here. Time is a concept. Also, Nidalry, how are you doing? Time is a concept. I uh, have, uh, I have no idea when people were here and when people weren't here. But yeah, this is my lizard and she's beautiful and I love her. Uh, so yeah. That's the thing. Um, and uh, we're gonna- we're just gonna jump in here and see what- what this is. I am hoping- okay, so I think we're gonna get to the new dungeon. Because there's still one dungeon that I'm missing for, uh, expert roulette, which I kind of want to unlock, but I also want to do the dungeon. Um, so yeah, that is what we're gonna be, uh, probably getting to today. Uh, like, very- a very high probability. And then also, uh, I was told about, you know, the alliance raid that I can unlock at a certain point in the main story quest, I think. So, uh, we're gonna have to do that, uh, eventually too, because I wanna do the alliance raid. But, uh, yeah, we're gonna see if I get there today. Might be, might not be. I talk a lot to people, uh, and if you, uh, if you have been here only for the last two weeks, uh, this is gonna be what I usually, what my streams are usually like. I talk a lot, and, um... Uh, main story quest usually invites a lot of discourse. Is that what you say? I don't know. Uh, but it's not- it's finally I can do content again that is not just like raiding. Uh, which is nice because raiding usually requires me to pay attention. And main story quest only does in a certain way. And I can also voice act a little bit, you know, and just like talk- talk sillyly. Sillyly? Silly? Uh, in- in silly ways. Uh, depending on who is speaking. Uh, so yeah, it's gonna be a little different, um, which is good. Time is BS, but I did see your aura. Okay, good. Uh, my soul was crushed when you turned into a potato. I feel like a lot of people felt that way. A lot of people have told me I missed a lizard, and I like the lizard a lot. And like, your Lala is cute, but I missed a lizard. And I was just like, oh god, are people gonna hate me now because I'm not a lizard anymore? Because people, uh... People, people are like that, you know? So yeah. Um, my first stream I saw of you was Bloodborne, but I think I saw your Lala first before you are. I think so too, yeah, actually. And again, I have a cheese brain. No, I think that's what happened, yeah. I think that is indeed what, what was going on. But yeah, this is my this is what I what my my character usually looks like. I change my hair all the time, so you might you might see like my hair change and like my eye color change a little bit. Well the the limbo rings, because you can't change the eye color directly, but those are probably gonna change and like some some things are probably gonna change because I like to change that But I this is like my favorite hairstyle. I think it is my original hairstyle and uh, I've been having that for a bit now and I'm really liking that so I might just stick with that for a bit um, We like your voice. That's good one day I'll do an ASMR stream and then uh, half of the people here will cringe and run away and the other half Is probably gonna be like, eh, it's not so bad <laughs> I would never say that lies. Absolutely, you're a liar. 
Um, also the lemon. I hope you're doing well, lemon. If you're good. I, I kind of abandoned lemon. Don't worry, I'll click accept in a second. I kind of abandoned lemon. Lemon lemon has to be our uh, Lalafell representative now for our C. Uh, because uh, lemon is now back to, you know, being a Lala still. Uh, and I went back to being an Aura, so I'm sorry, Lemon. Just to you personally, I know that. And then also Mia, I also, I'm also sad because of Mia. Uh, because I also enjoyed being in Lalafell together with Mia. That was also really cute. But I also think I might be going back, uh, depending on like what we do. And uh, maybe there's going to be like other charity things. And we can probably make that a goal again. Uh, it is heavily nerfing me, I noticed, in these last two weeks, but I think it's not its not too bad. Um, again, I think it's cute because, like, Lalafels are, again, I think they're adorable. Oslo Miesha! I managed to get here on time for Sakai going on tangents! Yes, always, 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 always. I feel like I haven't done that in a bit. Um, I feel like I haven't gone on tangents too much and I used to do that all the time What we used to do was I used to talk like when I started stream I used to talk for an hour just about random things with people and that was really really fun And and I'm not really doing that anymore because at the moment at least in the last two weeks We've had a lot of like grading going on and then you're in voice chat with people and you don't want to like, you know, you don't want to like make them wait when they want to clear content and all of that. And so I, and then I didn't do any main story quests. The main story quest usually invites, I mean we did, but also we did main story quest that was really overwhelming and I just wanted to continue it. And then you, I couldn't really say anything because there was just too much to unpack in main story quest. And so if it's too heavy, it's also difficult. <laughs> And then I cried all the time. I cried for eight hours straight, so I can't talk while crying either. So yeah, that wasn't it. The last few weeks have been an experience, certainly. Um, time to get the old voice recorder out. Lucky for you, there's something called VOTS. So you don't even have to voice record it. You can just, uh, you can just have a VOD. You can just look at the VOD. Uh, and also, uh, there's gonna be a uh, YouTube channel soon with... Probably all the VODs and maybe clips. I'm gonna have to see. I don't know. Uh, but yeah, and then they're gonna be uploaded so we don't lose them in the void after, I don't know, one month? Two months? Twitch Twitch saves these for a surprisingly long amount of time. So that is good. So if you're ever interested, I think they save it for at least one month. I think it might be longer. Um, but yeah, that is uh, that is what I'm gonna do. And the uh, Endwalker finale is also gonna be on there. Uh, I think we have everything uh, from the last two months, so definitely, like, Endwalker is in there. Not completely, I'm pretty sure, but uh, it is, um, there is, there is a good amount of bots that we have from that, I think? I don't know. Um, tangent stream in some time, move chill and relaxing. Yeah, actually, I like these. I like just talking to chat and just... Being relaxed, you know, and not having to look at mechanics and people doing the wrong call outs. Um, they're the spawn of the devil, like Timo. No, they're not. Timo is a whole different, very different issue. Um, we're always happy to wait. I hope you are. Uh, I used to tell people if you don't like me going on tangents because like I I used to have people here telling me like oh click the quest click the fucking quest click accept do the things we're here for main story quest and I was like yo if you don't like it go watch someone else because uh, um before you leave the party I'm gonna kick you yeah so kick me do it do it it's fine it's okay I can live with it um. Yeah, but uh, I was like, yo, if you don't like my way of streaming, then just watch someone else. There's so many great streamers out there that you can watch that probably go through the storyline, through the quests, and don't go on tangents for an hour before they start. Um, but yeah, also little Yuffie, how are you doing? How is it? How is it going, huh? How are you doing? People who do wrong callouts should be ashamed. I know, right? It's, it's uh, it, it, it dooms the party. Like, my god, imagine. People could die from that. It's, it's just awful. I say that now. If I ever do a callout wrong, I'm gonna, I'm never gonna hear the end of it. So we're gonna stop here, okay? And we're gonna forget that I said that, okay? Mm-hmm. 
Yeah. Wrong callouts. Yeah, wrong callouts. No, no. I, I can delete the clip. I don't care. I will delete it from every corner of the internet that you tried to put that on. Mm -mm. We don't do that here. We do not do that here. Tired but looking forward to relax on the weekend. Yes, that is good. Uh, weekends are never relaxing for me anymore, but then again, I have other days. It's just like streaming makes it so your like time is a concept anyway, but like streaming makes it so uh, it's, time is even more of a really weird thing and nothing makes sense anymore. And like, I don't know what day it is ever. Like, I don't, I don't ever know what day it is. I look at my schedule and I'm like, oh, I haven't streamed, so like, it's this day. And then like, oh, I have streamed twice yesterday, so it's this day, right? And that is how I know my days. And I literally, I don't know what's going on anymore in the world. It's just, I'm just existing. And then everything is like, you know, everything is just happening. And it, it, it is, it doesn't make any sense anymore. And then people tell you, oh, it's the weekend. And I'm like, I haven't had a normal weekend since forever, you know? And uh, it's, <laughs> it's like, oh yeah, the weekend, nice. Yeah, yeah, right. I have, I have, I suffer tomorrow in Bloodborne and in Coils of Bahamut. It's not the weekend, it is suffering. But yeah, you know, just, uh, just, uh, I guess gaming things. I don't know. Um... What is this? What did I just see? What did Twitch just do? Did my mod see that? Can you see what it just did? I think I think you can see or can anyone see that? I don't know. But that is interesting. What it just did. Uh, anyway. Um I think you're only missing one max two and walker vods. So we have the entirety of Endwalker on VODs. I did not know that. What? I don't know either. Can you see the suspicious user thing? Which is interesting today. Um, but yeah, let, let us let us start this, shall we? Let us start this. A uh, new found adventure and we get we get a thing. And I don't know what that thing is, but we get a thing. Uh, Tatara is putting on a pot of tea and looks in need of company. That was a rhyme. Nice. I want to know what happened. It marked Yuffie as a suspicious user because Yuffie used head pet. Uh, that is what Twitch is telling me, and I don't really know what why, but apparently Twitch doesn't like head pets anymore. Hmm, interesting. Um, Sakai, it's so lovely to see you. Yeah, it's lovely to see me too. I am also very happy. Yeah, I don't know why I did that. And everyone else is fine. I guess Yuffie, you giving head pets is just... Uh, Twitch has a pri- I, 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 Your head pets might be too powerful. I don't really know. Uh, if you're not in too much of a rush, I was about to make a pot of tea. Would you like a cup? Yes, of course. Take a seat then and I'll find us something to nibble on as well. Oh, Tataru. Does this work? Am I suspicious now too? No, surprisingly not. Everyone else is fine. I think Yuffie is just... oh, Yuffie's uh, head pets are just different, I guess. <laughs> Faulty integrated bot protection? Yeah, but it's like, it's not even bot. It's not even a bot. It's a... Uh, I don't know. It's so much quieter <gasps> these days without everyone around. Not that I'm pining for your return, you understand. I have my sources, and I Ow. know that each and every one of you is doing well and keeping busy with your endeavors. I didn't do anything, Arian. What is your problem? Hello. Why is that the thing that you do? I'm still impressed sometimes by how much Final Fantasy food models make me want to eat them. I know, right? I know. It looks so good. It's crazy. Why not? Literally, we had like 15 head pets, and then you come in here and you bonk me. I don't understand. <sighs> Meanwhile, I'm left with a surplus of free time and the question of how to make the most of it. What about you? Any plans for the immediate future? Take a lot of jeep poses, Tataru. Take a lot of fucking screenshots is my plan. Uh, grand new adventure. Yeah, sure. Why not? 
so they can hurt me again and <laughs> traveling to the edge of existence and back wasn't enough no well if that's the case i might have a suggestion for you you fought bravely and selflessly helping those in need and saving our star from I am, unimaginable threats i am so excited and like interested to see how they're gonna reset this but I, like i'm really happy that they're resetting it because dragging a story on for too long is i think we all know that it's super bad and i'm just like ending it like they ended it was really cool and now starting it over i'm really excited to see what they do but there's like this little bit of like fear that it's not gonna be able to grasp me in the way that it did before because now i'm just like what are they gonna do now right you just don't know what is what is going to happen because you don't know where to take it now because like what is there to do now right it's like the game ended <laughs> and now it's like what is there to do now but i know that they're they already like teased it right like i think xena said it it's oh no uh emmet said it Emmett was like oh you have to go to marikidia and then you have to i don't know find out who the 12 really are which was i think related to the alliance raid and that storyline um but yeah i don't know it's um it's really interesting to see what they have in store for us now and they, they said they were like planning like 10 years in the future or something right something like that that was crazy and i'm just excited and i want this game to always be here <laughs> forever <laughs> so yeah um yes for your deeds you've been hailed as the champion of eorzea and a host of other incredible things but why not put those titles aside for a while? Oh, sure. Acquit yourself as a simple adventurer again and travel the world in search of wonder. Oh, sure. Um, Final Fantasy XV made me so hungry all the time. <laughs> oh, I can imagine. Yeah. Graha, my beloved, the pink accent. Shut up, Yuji. Shut up. Uh, you're right, who knows what mysteries are still waiting to be discovered, that's a great idea. Yeah, whatever, this one. We're f full force, no brakes, all gas. New adventure, adventure now, please. Oh, that's the spirit. I can feel from here the blazing fire that just lit in your belly. Now, all you need is a destination. My destination is a uh, DSR. Thank you very much. If you're having trouble deciding, <laughs> and then just I want to kill myself. Savner, that's where you should go next. Okay. I doubt you were able to squeeze in a proper tour of Rads at Han the last time you were there. What with the burning skies and rampaging monsters and so forth, and I'm sure Retra would be pleased to see you. Then there's the bounty itself. The Empire's presence in the region was always a deterrent to exploration. So if you've a mind to sail that sea, now's your chance. Hmm, zero percent fear Yoshi P is a madman, I know. I Just know. Just think of all the new experiences you could have. Oh yeah, I'm looking forward to getting absolutely wrecked again by the story. Thank you very much. Oh, shut up. I don't want to see that. Have you been to the ruins beneath the waters of the Bounty? As the bearer of Azem's crystal, you may consider your duty to see at least that much. They're going full force again. Literally, they're, they're not, it's not, we're, I take everything back I said. They, they didn't end the story, they're just like, okay. Oh, I know that look. That's an adventurer ready to take on the world. <laughs> When are they gonna show? I I why haven't they shown Horshafor yet? I'm to give huh? you a new set of traveling clothes. <gasps> it's uh, still a work in progress. Sad. Um, w w when are they gonna show me Horshafor's fucking death again? Huh? You haven't shown that in ten take minutes. Much now though, so sit tight and I'll have the last few bits sewn up before you can finish another cup of tea. Um, I'm looking away. You never look away, do <laughs> Uh, I can't wait to do that again. It's gonna be great. Everyone's gonna lose their minds. Uh, make sure it has pockets. Okay, I really want to say you're the best, but I think Tatara knows she's the best. 
And I really need pockets in my clothes, so I'm just gonna say make sure it has pockets, because that is a thing. She's just like, you fucker. Now I have to change the- now I have to change everything again. Stitching here and trimming there. Not the threads with love and care. Huh? Just a little more to go. I'm sure you're still brimming with excitement. <laughs> I won with the needle. See how the fabric surrenders to my whims. Tatara's terrifying. God damn it. Don't worry. I'll make sure the lining has plenty of pockets for all your little treasures. Thank you. I swear adventurers are worse than children when it comes to hoarding every feather and leaf <laughs> and animal hide they come across. That is so true. You have no idea what kind of people I know, Tataru. You don't understand. Mm. Oh, we mustn't forget the waterproofing. Gods forbid you forget to disrobe before plunging into the sea, or a river, or a piping hot bath. Oh god, what is this? Oh, I'm so hyped! Oh, I'm so excited! Oh my god, yes, give me all of whatever is happening right now. I want all of it. Oh, I want all of it. Oh my god. Oh my god. And thus I am returned. Oh my god. Oh my god, I am not okay. <laughs> what did I just witness? Oh, never mind. We're still going. Good. Keep, keep it going, Yoshi P. Ah, you're awake. My apologies. I do get a little carried away with my sewing. You seem awfully cheerful. Pleasant dream? Or are you just looking forward to the next chapter of your grand saga? Oh, you have no idea. Either way, I promise to provide you with new apparel, and so I shall. If you'll accompany me to the Diamond Forge, we can put the finishing touches on your outfit. Shall we? If someone utters the word of one spoiler, hello Ikaza, yes. We will snipe them down, don't you worry. I still think this is such a bad sound, such a bad quest sound. It's fine for like most of the story and then you get to pain and suffering. And then it's like, and then it's like, hello? It, this is not the sound that I expected to be hit with. <laughs> the tower has also no concept of time, yeah. Hello. It is true. Uh, I changed my mount thing to mount roulette, so now sometimes we might get silly mounts. So now I just press this button and it puts- it gives me a random mount of the ones I have. Uh, so if you're ever like, what the fuck did I do? Why did you take out that mount? I didn't. The game did that for me. Uh, but I just couldn't. There, I couldn't. Like I didn't want an. I I didn't want an, another space for like mounts, and and now it's just like random. And then whenever I want a specific one, like from multiple people, I just go into my mounts, and then I just take that one out. I don't know. These are the top ten axolotl moments in Sakai's stream. Okay. Number one, that time Totoru charged Sakai 10 billion gil for a new outfit. She would never do that. 
She would never do that. She's way too nice. A smoothie? What you have there? A smoothie? <laughs> that was, yeah, that was a cutscene that we just saw. Um... It was a cutscene in a cutscene. Yeah? Yeah? Also, Amethyst, how are you doing, huh? How are you guys doing? Tell me at once. I wanna know. Uh, observe as the art artiste refines her piece into a masterpiece. And no napping this time. I only need a moment. You'll see. You will see. A little more room in the shoulders. Open up the cuffs. A final adjustment to the hem. All done. Let's see how it looks on a mannequin. Aww. Well, what do you think? Doesn't it just scream? Ready for a bold new adventure. That's so nice. I'm so glad you approve. Um, what do I owe you? Uh, yeah, this one actually. The tower, come on. Oh, don't be silly. Your approval is payment enough. If you really want to thank me, though, all I ask is that you wear this on your travels. I shall. Or at least anywhere lots of adventurers, adventurers might gather. Oh, I see what this is. Okay. They look at you, a famous hero, and wonder wherever did she pur purchase those stylish yet practical garments. And before you know it, hordes of new customers will be climbing over each other to to place orders at the Tower Tower's Boutique. Mwahaha! I can hear it now, the merry clink clink of gill overflowing from my coffers, sweet music to my ears. <gasps> oh, that is so nice. Wait, what? That looks so nice. Hello? Oh, I love that. Oh, I love that. They can't just give me a- they can't just give me a- they can't just start this off with giving me a glam. That is so, that is so illegal. Ahem, bur, bur, burgeoning, burgeoning, merchant empires aside, you must be excited to start a fresh chapter of your life. New places to go, new people to meet. I often wonder how you remember all those, all your experiences and exploits without taking at least a few notes. Oh, maybe you should start doing just that. You never know when some odd past detail might become relevant, or if one day you'll take a blow to the head and forget the better pa part of the past decade. Something to keep in mind, in any case. Imagine they actually make you lose your... Ooh. Imagine they make they actually make you... Oh, I've heard about this. They make you lose your your memory, and then they're, and then they're like, Oh, you have forgotten all your friends. Good luck. Um, I'm not gonna read through this, but that is super nice. I've heard about this. Um, I've heard about this being a thing. And then you can, like, unlock more if you go, go, if you, if you, like, get further in the story. The Unending Codex is now available under Collection in the Duty Selection of the main menu. New entries for prominent terms and characters will be added to the Codex as you progress through the main scenario quest. Yay! Mm, I added the necklace on my glimpse and the necklace looks really nice. It is so I and I think we're missing like good necklaces to be honest like accessories for glams are so Not great. I think we're missing a lot of like we could have so many nice things like especially necklaces I just think we're lacking a lot. I don't know um, doesn't have any pants though for some reason. Tatar does. T it's it's on purpose. Tatar doesn't doesn't want you to wear pants. Is the implication? Um, it's basically the same thing as in Mass Effect. If you've played that, uh, I have not. I have not. You will fall people confused for lack of pants. I know, right? Ihan, what is this? What is this contradiction? Uh, Bountiful Ruins, the tower has some advice to share with you. As the, uh, former receptionist and sometimes intelligence gatherer of the science, allow me to offer you a word of advice. Do not expect juicy rumors to simply fall into your lap. Adventurers rely on gossip, and the best places to pick up information are ta taverns and markets. At present, you only have a broad destination in mind. When you arrive in Tafnir, I suggest you explore your options at M Mary Mary's Mayhane. I still don't know how to say that. Um, 
the finest drinking establishment in Ratsadhan. Charm the employees and they'll not only point you to the direction of the local tell tellers, tale tellers, but also share with you the tricks for loosening their tongues. Now I really must be getting back to running my boutique. Enjoy the journey, Sake, and may fair fortune find you. Aw, thank you. Dun, 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 dun. Uh, let's uh, let's do this. Let's get some let's get some raiding gear on the way while I'm at it. I think I can actually buy more. I don't know. I need to unlock the alliance raid. I wanna I wanna do the alliance raid. Uh, but everything we're we're doing this step by step. There's a lot of things I need to do. Um, you get Grahana Codex. I was expecting as much. I was expecting as much. I'm excited. Like, why? I'm like wondering why they added that feature. Because, um, I mean, it's nice, but then also, like, why are they adding that now, right? Hello! I wore a pantless glam once and this is how I'm seen as now. Yes. Yes. Maybe it is because you're wearing it once and then everyone's like, wait, Ihan, what are you doing? Right? Everyone's so shocked. Uh, welcome to Marit's Mehain. Oh, hello. I did not recognize you at first. Are you here alone? Let me find your table. Ruins beneath the bounty. Would you be speaking of the sunken treasure vault? We have one regular, a historian, in fact. We could tell, who could tell you all about it? Ah, there he is, Professor Jal Jaleen? Jaleen? I thought I saw him come in. Although a somewhat private sword, the professor is quick to befriend those who share his fondness of the Mehain's unique beverages. Offer him any drink from our selection and he should happily share everything he knows about the vault you seek and a few other odd bits besides. Whatever you buy from him is on the house, by the way. If Marie found out I took coin from Thavnir's savior, I would ha she would have me scrubbing pods for a week. Okay. Mm, hello, Aranty. How are you doing? How is it going? Welcome in. Welcome in. We're doing main story quest. Yes, yes. That's just like how memes are made. They cure once and everyone never forgets it. Yes, exactly. Pantless labs are staring uh, at the party like they're just not. No, oh, I haven't even. I need to tell you what happened, though. Because we did one dungeon with Ihan earlier and it was uh, it was a uh, Hullbreaker Isle. And uh, there is a, a boss at the end, if you're familiar, it's a Kraken uh, or Kraken or however you say that. And uh, he, that thing, did not want to stab, stop grabbing Ihan and throwing him across the room. And I, I, I have a suspicion that it might be because of the glam. Uh, so that was a very enlightening experience in a way. Uh, so yeah, it's not only that, it is, there is a lot going on, there's a lot to unpack today, so, uh, yeah, I don't know, you know. Also, Lord King, thank you for the hydrate, and a head pet, and a posture check, my posture is as always amazing, I don't even need the posture check, my posture is just wonderful at all times, trust me. Mm. It must have been I saw the glam, yeah, I know, right? I know, right? Get a cracker was like, get away. No, it's more like. No, 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 Ryuji, the opposite. Because, uh, I'm pre Like, the Kraken, like, it grabs you with its tentacle. If you know what I'm getting at, you know? Uh, and that happened to Ihan like six times. So I, I have a feel. You know, I just have a feeling. You know? But I also don't want to get into it more. But I'm pretty sure you know what I'm, you know, what, what, what I'm getting at. The following event cannot be skipped. You may wish to cancel an MBI yeah, yeah, whatever. And I, I have nothing going on. We're fine.
Uh, and what may I do for you, my Orzian friend? I want to ask you about the sunken vault. Uh, uh, friendly chat, how about a drink? <laughs> this is so not suspicious at all. Well, I certainly wouldn't say no to a drink freely offered. I would not trust me. If I was this man and uh, my character came up to him, I would not trust. I would not trust that one bit. Here we are, one of Marie's finest. Enjoy. Ah, lovely. Bottoms up. Did it shout R? No. No? Why? How's Saki doing? Good. Good, 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 good. We're, um, we're chilling with main story quest. I missed main story quest. I did. I did, I did. Yeah, the streams are always pretty chill. Uh, Jolene empties the cub in a single pull. That was very kind of you, miss, but I know when I'm being softened up. What is it that you want from me? No, you know, there's like this place that I want to go to. Oh, chasing down, chasing down that old tale, are you? It does seem to appeal to the adventurers at heart. Now, where to begin? Might I assume you've heard of Al Zadal? He was Khan. Oh, Han, sorry, Han. Uh, of the Ori tribe which sailed to Thafnir from the mainland and a key figure of, in the history of Ratzat Han. <gasps> Ooh. His decision to aid the Ark of Sidara is what ultimately won them the war against the Ga Gajasura, thus allowing our predecessors to lay the foundation for this thriving city-state. A truly, the truly fascinating story, however, concerned his grandson Al Zadel III, who was known for his deeds at Sa as satrap at Ratzat Han's earlier days. <gasps> oh my God, the sky looks amazing! Look at that. Is that the final days again? What the heck is happening? <laughs> some uh, some attest that this man traveled to another world entirely and returned with glittering riches. Others that he brokered an alliance with a certain worm of the first bro brood. Ooh. Then there is the tale of the sunken vault, the one you seem most curious about. According to this legend, Alzadal III claimed a small island somewhere in the middle of the bounty. There he built a structure reaching clear to the bottom of the sea, a deep and secret storehouse, all and locked all his worldly wealth within. In a century since, whenever a natural disaster or hardship befell Ratzat Han, a fog would remember the tale of hidden treasure. Hardy souls would set out to claim their fortune, but precious few ever made it home. Would you like to hear more? <laughs> Apologies, I have a slight tickle in. Oh, my cup appears to be empty. Oh my god. Uh, Meal, me, me, another round for the professor. What is happening? I <laughs> uh, haven't played Final Fantasy XIV in a couple of weeks, been too busy. Oh, understandable. I feel like Final Fantasy is so you can put so much time in there, but then, like, if you don't, it kind of feels like you're not getting anywhere in a way. So, uh, a lot of times I see people, like, not playing it at all when they're busy, you know? Heresy, get on right now, you need your fix. Yeah, exactly. You need to get in there again, and then you need to get addicted, and then you need to not do anything else ever again. Little dragon is sleepy. No, I'm not. I would never be sleepy. Um, I'm working, yeah. So I can buy it after level 60. What level are you right now, King? What level did you leave off on? Also, you know that you can level every class to level 60, and that is probably gonna take some time, so if you don't want to get it just yet, just level other classes. It is pretty cool. Um, Sunsets are never the same again after the final day, is true. It's like, is it happening again? Or is this just a sun? Uh, I see we've reached an understanding. You're a sharp one, adventurer. 20 or something, when you be 25, I would just say just level until just level until 60 and do the story until then. And then have it you're probably gonna like heaven's story. There's a lot of content you can do. Uh there is no need to get the game right like get the full game right now. Um But yeah, you have you have a lot. You have a lot of things you can do at the moment. 
Um, I heard you yawning. So what? Oh, today was a splendid day to visit the Mayhem. Uh -huh, yeah, yeah. A filthy alcoholic. Jillian gulps down his newest drink with gusto. Gusto? Gus, gus, gusto? Where were we? Ah, uh, <laughs> yeah. Those who did return from seeking a treasure vault refused. I mean, flatly refused to speak of what they saw. Did this discourage others? Nay, quite the opposite. As such accounts only served to feed the legend and the golden lure grew stronger than ever before. That reminds me of something Azama was saying. Azama's a fellow connoisseur of spirituous portables. Yes, p p portables. Sorry. Uh, yes, yes, he is. Anyway, he was saying that one of his acquaint acquaintances <clears throat> went after the treasure himself. Hasn't been s seen since he set sail, I hear, but he did have... Ah, uh, no, I can't say no more. You seem a generous sort. What kind of man would I be to encourage that what is clearly... What is clearly a foolhardy quest? If my words send you to your death, I could never live with myself. I am no stranger to peril. Just taking advantage f f uh, of the free. Yeah, I would do so too. I think people very quickly buy the full game um, because of, uh, I guess because of the restrictions, because you can't trade, you can't like, you can't make a party and you can't use the market board. And I kind of get that, you know, if you're, if you're, if you're already understanding, if you're already like noticing that you really like the game, you can get the full game, but there's so much you can do in free trial, like story-wise and leveling characters-wise and, you know, um, that it's just, it, it's really good, I think. Is that so? Perhaps it's your turn to tell the tale then. What manner of dangers have you faced? All of them, my dude, all of them. The very edge of existence from anyone else. I'd struggle to believe it, but I recognize you now. You're the hero of the final days. A drink, I need another drink to settle my nerves. Miliel, more, more of the same if you please. I feel like they said her name and I don't remember how it said. As you wish, but this one is on your coin, professor. <laughs> oh no, now he's drunk, now you can make him pay. I, I see what she's doing. Uh, Yelene dr drains yet another cup dry. He's gonna be on the floor, what the fuck? Oh, he's gonna be on the floor, he's not gonna be okay. Anyway, you being who you are, I suppose it wouldn't hurt to share a little more. This friend of Azima's, he was desperate to buy a treasure map. One which showed the way to the entrance of, of the vault. Seems he could only get it from some merchant. What's his name? Ah, uh, I forget. Let's drink the toast to you, my new best friend. Millennial. More drinks. Uh, signal for water instead. <laughs> signal for water instead. We need to save him. He's not gonna be okay. Oh my god, the little wink. Oh god. That's amazing. You can also accept friend requests but not send them. Yeah, there's a bunch of restrictions that are just like one-sided. Right? Well, what I mean a bunch of. It's it's you can't be in a you can't start a party but you can join one and you can't send re friend requests but you can get one. And then probably other things I don't know know about. Your drink, sir. Ah, marvelous. I'm parched. Jillian gulps down the cup of water. Ugh, that was, that was water. Did you tell her to bring me water? Still, that's, that's probably for the best. The very kind of you, really. My head will certainly thank you in the morning. Ah, I seem to have overindulged. I'm put in mind of the words of Master Yelzen. Be wary of how much you drink, you swallow, lest it swallow you. Forgive me, I will- I, I'm not reading this right, but also that is good, because, yeah. Uh, <laughs> forgive me, I will subject you to no more of these unseemly, um, unseemly antics. If you want to speak with Azama, well, as I said, we share a taste for the mains, fine spirits. He probably came in as we were talking. I wish you fortune in finding your fortune. You appear to have learned all that Jellyane has to share regarding the undersea vault. To find out more, you will need to locate a man by the name of Azama. 
Yes, or Azama. I don't know how to say that again. Uh. Hi. I will fix my adventure played later, yes. Um. I also ordered water, yeah. Hey, plus for our voice acting. Hello, Naoki. How are you doing? How are you doing? Mm. And Chlorophyll, hello. How are you guys doing today? We're just doing some main story quests. Uh, some funny main story quests. We just, uh, if you were, if you were wondering what the fuck I was just saying, uh, the guy was drunk and I tried to, I don't know what drunk people sound like. I usually don't have many, you know, occasions where I get to hear that. So I, 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 I tried the best I could with my limited knowledge. Um, yes, I'm Azama, and who might you be? I think it's Azama. I don't know. Uh, all true, I'm afraid. My friend took a ship out in search of Alzadel's legacy, and I've been watching for his sails ever since. I tried to dissuade him, of course, but he refused to listen. All he could talk about was finding that vault. And that look in his eyes, I knew it wasn't common gold or jewels he lusted after. He was hunting Alzadel III's otherworldly horde, and his ambition would not be denied. I see it in you too, that appetite for the mysterious and the unknown. But I'll not attempt to turn you from your path. I know too well the futility of that endeavor. So I will tell you what my friend told me, how he convinced a merchant in the bazaar to give him the rough location of the vault's entrance. It seems this merchant, one Zasal, I believe, is selling a map which shows the exact route, but my friend's purse was too light for its exorbitant price. With what meager wealth he had, he instead paid to learn that there are ruins on a small island somewhere in the bounty, and within those ruins hides the path to the vault deep below. If you truly intend on seeking Alzadel's treasure, I suggest you put your affairs in order. I wish things were different, but I do not believe my friend is ever coming home. Rip. Rip. This music, yeah, I I think um, Razad Han music is uh, something else. <laughs> is something else. Please, Ashal, please, you must let me have that treasure map. Oh God. That's a fake. I can. What's I can. What's all this about? I can see that from miles away. My mother and father were slaughtered by monsters. My baby sister, still too young to fend for herself. Can you spare us no kindness? Hello, Chu. How are you doing? Good evening. So, you hope to find your fortune? And what? You expect me to surrender my wares for pity's sake? Nice voice actor. What have you to offer in payment? As I thought, come back when you've more than rags to your name. This is no mere treasure map. It is a guide to the vaults of Arzadal III, one of the great star tracks of Radzat Han, and a direct descendant of Alzadal Khan. Oh, it's actually Khan? A map to Alzadal's legacy. So he says. A fake I'd wager. This is no fake. The parchment is marked with an arcane glyph of passage. You may find the ruins hidden in the bounty, but you won't be setting foot inside without this in your possession. A priceless artifact is discovered amongst the rubble in the aftermath of the final days and lovingly restored by yours truly. This map is the key to fabulous riches, but I'll be the king of fools to simply give it away. Be glad I am no such king boy. Your scrawny eye did never return with that treasure alive. The new beast <laughs> music is a banger. I can imagine. I have a lot of experience oh, with drugs oh. for was. <laughs> Why must you tempt me with wealth I am powerless to claim? Oh my god. Um, I think I did well with the voice acting. 
Young people sound like sappy crybabies. Oh my god. I don't doubt that, honestly. My favorite part of this question is when Astinian says it's dragooning time and dragoons all over them. Yeah, okay. All right, Amethyst. Yeah, just take a step back. Reconsider what you type in Twitch chat. Oh, I shall envy the one who purchases that precious map. Whatever they pay will be but pittance against the golden hordes they stand to uncover. <sighs> God, what is happening? <laughs> Need some chills here with story time? I can, I can imagine. Ah, look at that! Don't, don't buy it, Astinian. No, I don't like this. No, no, don't, please. Oh, I oh, hate sir. this. Fighting many your no, steps, you surely relish the no, Astinian, no. Lost oh, Astinian, no. Oh, no. No, Astinian, no. No. A fortune, you say? <laughs> <laughs> I'm scared. If I had but the strength to seize that treasure, my starving sister would never want for food. I'll take it. Will this cover the price? Uh, what the fuck is the <laughs> stop? It's a scam! It's 100% it's a scam. I'm just, I... Uh, whatever, it's fine. It's okay. Can I just walk up to him and slap him? Well met, my friend. Someone is dressed for adventure. You're saying that. St don't say that. I'm not even wearing your glam game. Don't tell me that. But why Favner of all places? Knowing you, I suspect there's more to your plans than sightseeing and shopping. Game was like, you should be wearing the outfit we gave you right now. Why are you not doing that? And here I've acquired a map to just such a sight. With that sale, I do believe I've earned the rest of the day off. Thank you for your patronage, sir. But if you'll excuse me. Yeah, he is he is running. He will we will never see him again. He is he is leaving this place forever with the money that he just got. He is he doesn't need to do anything anymore in his life. He's he's good. He's good. Hope you're doing good too. I am doing well, yes, true. I'm, I am. We're just, I'm just chilling with main story quest. Main story quest is good. I'm excited. I'm excited to see what, what they have in store for us now. Yeah. Hey, Stinia, wouldn't you like to buy this picture from Maki? It'll be a lot, it'll be worth a lot in the future, yeah. Stinia would 100% get into pyramid scheme this. Actually, he would. 100%. There, like, he would be, I don't know. It, it, it's just, he, it's just so, I don't know. He's such a funny character. He's almost, to me, he's almost like a comedic, like, he's a comedic relief character. He's really cool, but at the same time, like, he's so, he's so lost. He was never taught how to live life like a normal person, right? So now he's just like a lost child running around, and it's just so funny to observe. Mind us. This guy is this guy is scamming us. And now I've fleeced one of the heroes of the final days. Pray the sisters were looking elsewhere. Well, okay. This map may or may not be genuine. Either way, we'll need a ship to find out for sure. Um you seem here to be on your way. I never took you for a tour run. Uh, you seem here to be on the way. Where's to tell her what we need I her? I seek the treasure not for myself. When? Okay, but MVG, when do we not need Tataru? Like, is there ever a time we don't actually need her? 
If such a fortune truly exists, then it could help ease the struggles of those who lost their loved ones in the final days. I hope to do for Thavnir what you and Alphano did for the Alamegans when you recovered the Mad King's trove. Ah, uh, there's different val- right, let's hope that bag was full of one guild coins, there's different value guild coins. That is actually a good question, but I think there is, because the, um, you have the, the bags, right, like the golden bags, and I think what the, like, it's platinum pieces or bronze pieces, right? Like, what you get from, like, quests sometimes is quest reward. And I feel like these are, like, they have platinum, they have bronze, they have gold pieces, like the elegant things, right? Like, these, I feel like that is, that is what you would have as different currency, I imagine? Like, different levels. Come now. You know Alphano needs little encouragement when it comes to recounting the tales of your shared exploits. Speaking of precocious lads, that boy in the bazaar was clearly an accomplice of the merchant. Suppose his role was to draw the attention of the crowd and add weight to the merchant's bold claims. Transparent act for the most part, it was not all mummery. The need to provide for his sister rang true enough. Thus, if some portion of the profits end up in that waif's pockets, then I will consider it money well spent. Whether the map leads us to the vault or not. You are coming along, yes? Naturally. <laughs> I thought as much. Now, let's see about securing a vessel. They never said no. I don't think they ever talked about it. And that is just one of the things where you it, basically anything goes. Like your head cannon is uh fine. And I'm not to go about uh I'm not about to go on a investigation spree for RP or like, you know, like uh figuring the truth out on facts in a in a fictional, you know, in a in a, uni in a fictional universe. I used to do that when I RP'd. I used to look up a lot of things to just be sure that I'm doing the right canonic cano ca canonical thing. But I'm beyond that now. I can't just, I can't be bothered. It's like your head cannon is probably fine. And if it makes sense, it, you know, who cares? Um, not coming in long 6.1 end credits. Exactly. That would be so funny. Imagine. Uh, it's like near, it's like near Automata, uh, like fun endings, you know, like joke endings. Uh, you will recall I spoke of visiting Thafnir at Vithra's request. Well, he finally invited me to a feast and made his proposal once I was too full of Hanish delights to refuse. He wishes me to train the Radiant Host in Lance work. <gasps> but that is a tale for another time. What we need now is a merchant or a trawler with a ship fit to the op for the open seas. Matsya is a fisherman by trade. Yes, we should head to Akiali and see if he can help us. Adventure time! Yay! Adventure! Woo! Uh, where is that? Oh, great. I can't wait to go there. Uh, what would be the fastest? Here? I just go here. I don't know what the fastest way to get there is. I have not unlocked flying yet in most areas in Endwalker. I haven't even unlocked flying in uh, a lot of Stormblood areas. Nice mount. I don't want that. Give me a good one. That is a perfect, amazing one, actually. Um, and I like the I like the sitting position on that one so much. Oh, it's so beautiful. It's so wonderful. Um, I need to unlock flying in so many areas. Still, it is actually sad. But I'm lazy. 
I, I know I unlocked flying in Elpis because I was like, yo, I need to fly here. There's so many like cool, cool places. But for everything else, I was lazy. And I think I, I'm actually still missing areas in Stormblood areas. <laughs> but like Stormblood areas are really terrible. I feel like Stormblood areas were some of the most terrible areas to unlock flying in. Because they had just such like, they had really big multi-leveled areas and they make you like walk all the way around the map just to get one. And if you don't have, hello Yumi, if you don't have, if you don't have, um, if you don't have uh, someone to fly you around, it's like so bad to get there. It just felt so much more annoying than the other areas, I don't know. But maybe I'm just, maybe I'm just traumatized by that one area. Um, my friends, what brings you to our humble village? Need a ship, please. One, one ship, please. So you need a seaworthy vessel to seek these ruins. Considering it was your deeds which allowed us to return to fishing, I should think everyone would be glad for a ch chance to repay the favor. Wait here and I will have a boat stocked and ready for you in no time at all. Have you noticed our little shadow? He's been following us since we left the city. We see you there, boy. Show yourself. Ah, it is you. Do you know how far out of your way we walked so that you'd not cross pa paths with some wild beasts? I'm sorry, sir, but aren't you the heroes who saved Thafnir? You are, I know you are. And I've gone and cheated you. I work with the cell, you see, and the map the and the map merchant. It's my job to play the ple pleading orphan and convince the crowd the wares are worth the price he asks. I'm ashamed of what I've done and beg for your forgiveness. If not for you, my sister and I would have never well, I'd be we'd be Enough. I know your game, and I paid the price willingly. A fortunate purchase, as it turns out. But my friend here was seeking those very ruins. You're too kind to overlook the wrong I have done you. But there's more you need to know. The map you bought is very real, and as is the island it shows. I overheard Zasal selling the information to another customer. He told that man where he needed to search, about the ruins, about the vault, about everything. Then the man sailed out to find his fortune never to return. You cannot go alone to that place. You should have more friends with you, maybe even a whole army. I do not doubt the ruins hold danger, but I assure you, between the two of us, there is little we cannot overcome. Please, I cannot bear the thought of, of... Uh, we could have met a comrades. We might need a hand moving the treasure now. Uh, now you've gone and made him cry. Oh my god, this one actually. I need to. I need this. Estinian is my, like, comedic relief character and I, I just, I, I just need some of these answers. I did not. That was not my intention. <laughs> Uh, what is happening? Oh my god. Thoughts. Uh, Jesus Christ. Uh, very well. Assuming we do find this treasure hoard, it may prove wise to have more hands along for the carrying. Any ideas on whom to approach? The signs have scattered far and wide since our last gathering. Oh my god. Oh my god. Um, Stormblood ha was my favorite raids and environments. Um, I enjoy- I, I- I- don't get me wrong, I like the environments, I like- I like the maps, I- I like Stormblood, I think it's pretty underrated. Um, but getting the ether currents was a pain, I think. I picked all the comedic reliefs in this patch, understandable, we need some comedic relief. Agrahan Kryl. Aye, Kryl may have her hands full rebuilding the students, but if you reach out to Graha, he would surely leap at the invitation. He, uh, ha, he better. Uh, will that set your mind at ease? Y yes, if that man is as strong as you. Is he, though, strong, I mean? Oh. Yes. 
What is your name, boy? Uh, Mer Merad? Merad? Well, Merad, your life is yours to live as you will, but I suggest you find a more honest trade if you truly wish to keep your sister safe. I'm not proud of what I do, but what choice do I have? We need to eat, and everyone's too busy rebuilding their own lives to bother with two grubby orphans. Wait, boy. I didn't take this roundabout road just to see you end up in some creature's belly. Let me walk you back to the city gates. Thank you, sir. Call me a Stinian. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. It's no longer a pain anymore collecting ether currents for heaven so then storm but at least uh just a measly four and right next to main circle. Oh, did they change it for them? I know they changed it for uh Shadowbringer areas, but I wasn't aware they I don't know. I wasn't aware they changed it that much. Um, friends for the road. Estinian is ready to escort a Marat to safety. I shall leave you to recruit Graha. He'll appreciate the invitation that much more, I'm sure. As I recall, he was based at the Annex. Someone there ought to be able to point you in the right direction. Let us be off to Marad. Do me a favor and don't stray from the path. Estinian? Estin- Estinian? Estinian? Uh, wait, I can return there. Mm, all five before current. There are only a few. Still need to get uh, those for Shadowbringers and Warcraft. I also need to, yeah, I also need to get a lot of current still. Oh. I haven't run an alt, so I'm not aware of the changes. Yeah, I, I don't know. I don't know either. I'm here. I, I would like one Graha, please. Uh, look who it is. Welcome back, Sake. What might the students do for you? Graha, yes. He is in the main hall with Mistress Kryle. They've been holed up in there for days. By all means, go and give them an excuse to take a break. Uh, just one Graha? There's only one. The one and only... Ah, Ergica, my good man. Would you be so kind as to... <laughs> Hello? Oh, isn't this a pleasant surprise? I wish you had sent word ahead. I thought I was having visions for a moment there. Oh my god. <laughs> um, what are the two of you working on? Raha and I have been compiling old records of the students' activities. We were able to locate several accounts in the archives of Numenon, but the bulk of our documents was lost along with the Isle of Fal. What if you could have two Graha or three, but there's only one! The one, this one, the one, the real but one and only Graha. what brings you to the Annex, my friend? Surely you haven't come all this way just to watch us shuffle dusty papers around? I wanted to ask for an adventure, Graha. <laughs> Didn't you want to go on an adventure with me, huh? The treasure vault of Alzadar III. And you're looking for companions to join you on this expedition. Yes. Oh, I would dearly love to accompany you, of course, but I'm afraid I'm committed to another task. On the subject of which, I had hoped to ask for your assistance. <laughs> what is happening? Oh no! Oh no! 
Then again, it's not so urgent that it can't wait until you've returned. Is he okay? Baha. I'll stay here and mind the shop, as it were. Is he okay? <gasps> Are you sure? I'd hate to leave you short-handed. I'm sure. Just try to be back before too many moons have passed. Well, I guess we're off on another adventure already. Oh! Uh, his voice, How like the voice acting, I can't. Off? Then we don't I need any. We invite your we... Oh yeah, we can do that. Sure. <laughs> Ever since the Scions disbanded, she spent most of her time cloistered within the Great Google Library, hoping to piece together a method to traverse the rift. It would seem, however, that whatever wisdom she sought there was not to be found. She arrived in Charlian the other day. We spoke briefly before she began her search of Numenon. Considering what you've told us of Alzadal's extraordinary feats, I do believe your Stola would be more than interested to hear what you have to say. Final Fantasy is a more gratia wants to go on an adventure. Splendid. Uh, then let us head to the archives at once. Actually, the voice actor, if you didn't know, uh, his name eludes me right now, but the English voice actor plays a role in... What is it called? I'm pretty sure someone here knows. Uh, in in that one show that I forget, and there's like a there's like a voice he like recorded a voice thingy for I don't know it wasn't Spotify it was some other it was some other like um, audio thing and you and it's basically like ASMR, uh, but it was like it was supposed to be for the character he plays in that show. But then, like, people, like, Final Fantasy fans found out about that, and obviously, you know, he sounds very similar to Graha. So then, so that's getting abused. But I haven't looked into that. I'm just like, that that's too much. Wait, there. before you Richardson, go, yes. I have another potential Jonathan member to Bailey. volunteer, if you've room to spare. Urianger. <gasps> Wait, I thought the signs were disbanding. I'm just so confused. I thought we wouldn't hear, hear of them. He sent the students a request for materials, you see. Treatises on the architecture of treasure vaults and the like. From what I can gather, the Loperits are looking to make improvements to their own creation and wish to learn more about how we build things down here. Aww. So, why not take Urianger with you? Let him study Alzadal's legacy firsthand. So I'm taking all the nerds, I like it. None can deny the benefit of seeing something with your own eyes. If our expedition leader has no objections, I say we extend Urianje an invitation once we've spoken with your Stola. The nerds plus Estinian, ugh. Safe travels, you two. But don't forget, I'd still like your help with that other matter I mentioned. A Estinian is a special case, okay? I can't even put a label on right. him. Right. Then it's off to the library. Oh, I love you. <laughs> The Azur Dragoon, yeah, I guess that is the title of choice. Um. Oh goodness. Um, the signs may have expanded, but the friendship didn't. Yeah, actually true, yeah, I guess. I just thought they, I don't know. I, again, I don't know what they're gonna do now. I don't know where the story is gonna go. I don't know how much we're gonna see the signs still. We're gonna see. The ragged book the words, shut up. Don't call me that. <laughs> what is this? What is this beautiful scene that I'm seeing right now? 
I am about to go into G pose. Oh. Oh. That's so cute. I'm just gonna take pictures like this. I don't need that. Uh, oh. Oh. That is so cute. What, what is he saying to that? She wasn't hard to find at least. That's so nice. That they did that, right? I've never known you stole her to doze off in the middle of research before. witness how long have you two been here that was the most amazing scene in all of Final Fantasy 14 you cannot convince me otherwise what did I just witness that is amazing <laughs> that was so good what the fuck We just arrived, we didn't want to wake you. Catching up on some- Uh, we didn't want to wake you, I guess? Oh, That was so nice. Nor did I want to fall asleep. Oh, You almost got it, Blackfire. You almost got it. I must have been studying for two, three days straight before exhaustion finally claimed me. Huh? <laughs> As you know, I've been researching ways to travel from the source to one of its reflections. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Well, looking for hints at least. I don't expect to find a simple set of instructions tucked away in some dark corner of the library. So I've been skimming through the stacks, hoping to uncover even a partial mention of any similar feats in the past. A means to travel between worlds exists, and you can be sure I will find a way to employ it. So I've promised Runar, but it would seem I've set myself a nigh impossible task. How cool would that be though if they actually if they actually make that happen? You needn't be so hard on yourself. The leap I made with the Crystal Tower was not achieved in an afternoon. It was the culmination of a collective effort spanning generations. Oh, you think me discouraged. I assure you, tis quite the opposite. A daunting challenge and the time to sink my teeth into it. I feel like a fresh-faced student again. A scholar in her element. Indeed. Was there something else you wished to ask of me? Alzadal is no minor figure in Harnish history, and much is known about his family. 
Um, hello, Alice, this Yana? This is the first I've heard of a descendant surviving a trip to another world. Welcome in, welcome in, hello. I hope you're doing well. If those tales are true, then he may have left behind some clue as to how it was accomplished. An invitation to delve into one of the world's lingering mysteries. As if I could refuse. Yeah, and this is... Embark upon this, expedition? this is way quicker. Like, they're getting together way quicker than I thought. I thought we were legitimately just gonna, like, I don't know. Do something entirely Akiyari, else. My ship. But before that, we thought to extend an invitation to Urianje as well. He was in Thalmazain, last we heard. Then by all means, let us recruit him and be on our way. Last minute studying, uh, last minute studying doesn't look like this. La last minute studying doesn't look like this. Oh god, oh god, um... Do I... Is this where I'm supposed to pour it or am I so- No, I just, I'm just gonna go there. Milkshake man, oh god. I'm just thinking back to that scene in uh, to that scene here, when you find all the scholars and then you find Munbrida's parents and that whole scene that went down there, and I I don't think I'll ever recover. I don't think it'll ever not hurt seeing that. Add what mount are we getting, huh? Ah, uh, that's fine, I guess. Cursed. This is a. This is a. This is such a cursed mound. I don't even. But the sitting position is really cute. Look, it's so cute. And then you see what I'm sitting on, and it is absolutely fucking terrifying. But hey, it still hurts seeing that it does. Everything. Everything hurts. Everything. And Walker hurts seeing. Honestly. Why is that still here? My immersion is ruined. That should not be here. This should not be here. Um, the pain is eternal. Hello, Jack. It is indeed. Uh, we we will always suffer. Need a good month to recover from Endwalker. Yeah. Ah, yeah, I our feel that. illustrious champion. Ah, uh, our. I'm not. I'm not gonna say anything. Cloaked in the mantle of the common explorer, fame set aside in thy pursuit of simple adventure. I should. They really want me to glam this, don't they? They have. But this is the second time they talk about my outfit. I am told a new expedition is in the offing. But I like to think mine is, I, I don't know, I deliberately chose this because I think it looks, it looks similar to what they want me to wear. Um, tis good to see you I wasn't thankward with you. Um, uh, tis good to see you well. I, he's probably going to talk about thankward anyway. And thee, as ever, thou art the picture of strength. Oh, Oriage, come on. You've been keeping yourself busy, I trust. True to our plan, Thancred and I embarked upon a pilgrimage of sorts, with an eye for gauging the state of those lands through which we passed. Our travels were interrupted, however, by a request for aid from our beferred lunar allies. As you may recall, the Loperets have been seeking new purpose for the moon. Another role through which it might serve to benefit mankind. The Forum hath been working to advise them in this endeavor, but I return to offer mine own counsel. And this has what to do with treasure vaults, exactly? 
Ah, you have learned of my predicament from Mistress Kryle. I know not whence they acquired such knowledge, but the Loperits now stand convinced that adventurers delight in treasure hunts. Everything hurts. Sake 2022. That is actually so accurate. You have no idea. Thus, with their newly built wonderland of riches and mystery, do they hope to entice all manner of daring delvers to the moon? So earnest and innocent was their desire to bring joy to the world that I found myself powerless to refuse them my cooperation. But what of you, my friends? Why are you come to Labyrinthos? Fascinating. This is indeed a most fortuitous opportunity. Uh, you're right, MBG, but it is also... It should be here. It should be here, but it should not be in Ultima Thule. But if you if you go to Ultima Thule, it is also there, so... I should be honored to accept thine invitation. Something doesn't add up here. Unless they send another... It, another one that looks exactly the same up there. For whatever reason. How long has it been, I wonder, when last our actions were not impelled by fate or desperation? Aye. Though I cherish the Scion's accomplishments, it is pleasant to not have the weight of the world upon our shoulders for a change. True. Counting Istinian, we number five now, yes? Without knowing what traps or perils await unwary feet, we may be wise to refrain from recruiting others. I agree. Between us, we should have the skills to handle whatever situation may arise. Shall we be on our way? What, no time to spare a word for the grizzled old bard? There he is. <laughs> All is well, I trust. A wasted trip, I'm afraid. I'd hoped to catch up with a former mentor while you parleyed with the rabbits, but it seems our paths were not to cross. Um, how was your pilgrimage? Having an astrologian beside you on the road is surprisingly convenient. Ah. And it doesn't hurt <laughs> he's making strides with his light-hearted banter. <laughs> Ah, oh, thank God. You have no idea how right you are. In any case, as we made our way around Ilzabad, we saw that much of the continent was in various stages of chaos. A certain amount of disorder is to be expected. The final days are over, and the people no longer have a common threat binding them together. That's the thing with these fledgling troubles, eh? You need to keep an eye out, lest they mature into full-grown headaches. So, for what reason have so many esteemed personages seem fit to gather? Adventure. Beneath the waters of the bounty, you say? I see you've already stolen away my traveling partner with the promise of unexplored ruins and scholarly glory. Oh, sure, yes. Um, the game, uh, there's an in, in lore reason for the Ragnarok being an Ultima Thule if you talk to an NPC. Ooh. Uh, you used it to travel there even though you wasted the money of the Aetherite teleportation. Yeah, see, that is why we can just teleport the, to the Aetherite. Yeah. They explained in a side quest. Ah, so they actually went out of their way to make it seem logical. Okay, all right. Um, this is Thancred. This is indeed Thancred. He's right. Makes da not dying a little easier. Depends on how evil that astrologer is. Nay, it is not for mine own indulgence, but rather the fulfillment of my commitment to the Loperitz. Ah, of course. And if you have a Stinian rounding out your group, you'll likely have all the members you need. Feeling left out? I could put in a good word for you, if you like. Uh, 
We may have been released from our obligations, but I'll never be free of that merciless wit of yours, will I? <laughs> In all seriousness, it is best I sit this one out. Too many former scions consorting with one another might be seen as a cause for concern in certain quarters. I'll return to my usual reconnaissance and scout out the situation in the Far East. Feel free to share if you come across any interesting revelations. Till we meet again. Shall we also hasten our departure? Sir Estinian will wonder what hath become of us. Yay! Another sign pops up. Sub peeps, <laughs> why is everyone here? Yeah. Also, sorry, we were in a cutscene. I was on cutscene mode. I hate it here. I'm so sorry. Um. Oh, great. Neo cold. <laughs> <laughs> and Neo is here! Oh no, oh god, oh Zar, oh, good luck. Good luck. Good luck. No, 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 this is on you. No, 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 this is your problem. This is your problem. Also, Neo, why aren't you streaming? I want to raid you. And, uh... That would have been funny. How was your prog, though? I haven't done anything? No, you haven't. Not today. But I think, I think you've traumatized a certain individual. Uh, yeah. Where it's over for today? How was it? Is it good? Yeah. Is this? Okay. I have seen this, right? This is super sus. If I may if I may say this. I have been there, I have been to this platform and it's like so weird. And I think that might be main story quest stuff, but we shall see, we shall see. Hello. Uh, I send you to recruit Graha and you return with an entire survey party. I hope Matsya's boat is sturdy enough to carry us all. We'll be fine. What he means is, uh, we are grateful for the use of one of your precious fishing vessels. Uh, Elon Musk is Alpha. Thank you for the follow. Welcome in. Uh, nice name. Nice name. Um, no proc, but a bit more consistency. That is good, though. That is good. Um, that's the special fate base. Oh, it's okay. I see. Okay. Okay. All right. All right. Mm. We are more than glad for a chance to provide it. I ask only that you take care to steer clear of the reefs and the shallows here. Aye, right, we will keep an eye out. Uh, I'll just take this. Uh, Elzadel's legacy. That looks fucking cool. Uh, Yishtola is intrigued by the legend of Alzadel the Third. Uh, you do, I think you have to f I don't know, we have- I don't know. You can fight for a spot, okay? For the dungeon. Uh, if Yumi wanna join, we have all people together. Uh, if- if everyone who was here wants to join, everyone who was present at the fire just now, I can invite all of you guys and we're gonna do the dungeon. If you want that, if not, let me know, then I'll search for someone else. Um, I'm here as well, but can't see any of you guys. Uh, I think you might be in a different reality than we are. Sorry. Uh, hello! Do I just call you Elon? I'll just call you Elon. Hello. <laughs> I hope you're doing well. Welcome in. Uh, Alzadel th III. I confess I'm somewhat embarrassed that the tale of his journey to another world escaped my notice. Could it be more than simpl simple folklore? <gasps> I love this music. And what of the treasure he supposedly brought back? This undersea vault may hold relics from another reflection. My friends, we should temper our expectations. The map doth promise ruins, but beyond that we know not what we will find. 
not until we find it, I. So let us dispense with the conjecture and set sail, con conje conjecture, and set sail for the vault. I have a feeling they're gonna make us go to another world again, like the first. Because they've been all about that, right? I have a feeling that might be a thing that we're gonna be doing. Alzadel's legacy, now accessible, yay! I'm just gonna go with trust. Fuck you guys, I'm just gonna go with trust now, we can do this. Um, reality hates me, you're just in a different plane of existence, don't worry. Um, I want to join. I'm troubleshooting things at the moment. What are you troubleshooting on them? Is your PC bullying you? Um, let's see if these people are here. You got experts? Yes, I know. I get expert. I get expert roulette if I do this. It's gonna be nice. Um, yes, new dungeon. New dungeon. Uh, lick the etherite. <laughs> nice typo. Uh, click the etherite to change. Are you, I think, isn't, no, MBG is, uh, yeah, you're probably just in a different instance. But you're probably aware how to do that, right? Uh, you can pull wall to wall if it makes you happy. I don't mind. <laughs> I can look around some other time. I, I, I'm i gonna go in there as a... They have a exploration mode, right? We can just go wall to wall if you want. Um... Next hand of party might be a hand of prey, you never know. Um... <laughs> um... Yeah, okay. That looks fucking cool. Oh my god. I'm excited. Alright, let's do this. Is everyone ready? Wait, let me do let me do a ready check. <laughs> mercy. He's not gonna have mercy. You know, you know how this is gonna go. Oh look at you. Oh damn! I- I should've- we should've waited. I wanted to see that outfit, MBG. I swear to god. Shit. Oh god, what is happening? I'm scared. This is some... What? What is going on? Even just the promise of suffering keeps you on your toes. Oh my god. Oh my god. Crash Bandicoot music? <laughs> Why did you tell us that? <laughs> I did not want to hear that today. Also, my weapon absolutely does not fit my glam, but it's okay. It smells like adventure? It sure does. Um... Licking power work. I want to see your glam. Maybe they import me though, so I don't know if I can be back to look at the glam. Died of pink. What do you? My my outfit. My outfit. My glam. Which glam are we talking about? Yeah. 
Yeah, I don't think I'll ever, I, I, I'll ever not think about Crash Bandicoot now when I hear this. No, stop. The Wanderer's outfit? Yeah, it is, uh... I, I feel like they really want you to glam. I feel like they really want you to glam. Their story outfit thing, they, they told me twice. I'm like, the, the, hello? <laughs> Leave me alone. Steam. I wonder if the music was inspired by that? Uh, probably. I don't know. Oh god, what is that? <gasps> oh no. That looks cool though. But I'm also scared. Whatever that- I'm scared. What the fuck? Do not- okay. I don't like that. I just thought a very similar boss earlier. I don't like it. not to like about that boss everything I hated that I was so confused you have no idea it confused me so much because I never know what what's going on at that boss uh, if anyone's wondering Hullbreaker Isle the the boss that I was talking about I just I I will never understand that I don't think I I don't think I'll ever I'll ever know what you're supposed to actually do there. It's just like, you just have to fight the tentacles and then at some point it just dies? I just do not understand. Uh, I'm fucking dead. Yumi, were you standing in both at the same time? What did I just witness, huh? <laughs> Oh, that is not good. This is fine. We're good. Um
trying to predict te two tentacles to here is a little difficult. It is, because like you think you're safe. What is this? What is happening? Oh my god, we're going underwater. Oh my god, we're going underwater. Oh god. Um, it is not. It's, it's, uh, it's a little weird to- Oh my god. Cliff of passage detected, confirming Beerus identity. Oh god, what is this? That is so cool. That is really cool. I was laughing so hard, it was so funny. I was scared because I thought everyone would be dying on me. Because we were all struggling just a little bit. You know? How are you doing? I uh, still so haven't done the first boss enough to to get it. What what are we talking about? Last time to get some more health, but yeah, that's it. Yeah, it is super weird. It is a super weird. I don't like it, it's so different from everything else. I don't know. Weekend? Yes, 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 yes. I feel like a lot of people are... <gasps> Look. That is really cool. Um, a lot of people are really looking forward. Oh, this is where the gear is from. Read it. So this is where people get this gear from. I was wondering. Oh damn, there's more. Oh my god, and it, this looks- Oh my god, I'll be spending so much time here. So I'm sorry, you, there's no healing for you. I have to look at the glams. <laughs> But yeah, weekend weekend is weekend is nice. Again, I'm not I don't have a I don't have a weekend. For me, weekends are usually more more streams, more things. I don't know. Oh, I did not mean to do that, but that will work. Crab with a crown on. That is a very interesting design. <laughs> Clam is always more important than anything else. I know. Party wipe doesn't matter. We can just we can just go back in. But like, looking at looking at nice looking. This is actually really nice. We don't have enough like necklace options and everything. Oh, I don't like the layout of this. But eh. Um, no, I don't need those. Glam is the true end game. Yes, definitely. But yeah, I'm good. I'm glad you're doing well, Misty. Glad you're uh, 
You're having a chill. I hope you're having a chill. I hope you're gonna have a chill weekend. Mm. For whom do you find Mr. Glam? Yes. I don't need to know what we're doing. Pull it. We'll be fine. What am I looking at? Trap, Alzadel the 14th, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Aha, uh -huh, I don't like this. Can we stand here? You can take a nice relaxing one for your birthday. <laughs> my, my, my birthday? What birthday? What birthday? It's the shield hero, like uh, like the anime. God, that is a. That is an anime. One was better. Is there a season two at, at this point? I watched season one. I don't know if I watched season. I don't think I watched season two. Uh, I lost interest. It was so. How do I put it? It just became so. Like all the characters became so annoying, and um, I don't know. It was just too. It was just. It, it, there was too much going on that just didn't feel like it had any purpose. I don't know. Uh. You mentioned your schedule announcement thing. I guess you meant your anniversary. Oh no, I, yeah, sure, yeah. Yeah, 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 definitely. Uh, where are we, hello? Why is this thing doing a, why is this thing doing a, Please, I'm scared. Firefly season two is gonna come out. I have no idea. 
I have no clue. Last time I watched an anime was way too long ago, but I also like- I, f I don't feel like I have time, ever. You know? On episode 4 or 5 now. So it's currently running, like it's currently- it's currently going. I did not know that. Again, I have pretty much- I don't know. I'm so not informed about anime at the moment. I don't need this, do I? Does it look nice? Eh, it's fine. That is not where the glamour dresser spot. Is it worth the watch, Shield Hero? Uh, I think the, f the start of season one was fine. And maybe you'll like it, I don't know. I feel like I'm a little picky with, with that stuff, but um, I feel like season one was okay at the start, but then it kind of just got worse. And then I didn't like it anymore, really. And then it just felt like it was going nowhere. It just felt like it was not, there wasn't, I don't know. It was, it was a weird anime in general, in my opinion. It wasn't bad, it was like a, I don't know, it was fine. But, yeah, I don't know. Morbius is my favorite anime. Actually, same. Mobile glamour dresser. I mean, we technically have a mobile glamour dresser. You just need to have all the things in your inventory, uh, in your in your armory chest, right? Then you can just glam it. Okay. Season I thought Morbius meme died. Morbius meme has been dead since dead since minute one. I'm sorry. I never thought it was any I never I I'm just so no about it. I don't know. Oh my god, what did what just happened on my screen? Um, what is going on? I'm scared. Are we good? What is happening? <laughs> what just happened? Alright, that is a fever dream and a half, I guess. How do I know- how do I know where the fuck it puts me? What the heck? That is not good. 
Yeah, I don't understand. I don't under. Oh, you can. You can like. Okay, I see. All right. Uh. You have to. You have to. You have to. That is not. That is not good. I'm gonna die. What kind of weird mechanic am I- what am I witnessing right now? I'm so confused. See that set that 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 in Savage. Uh, I can I can't wait. Very long a very long time. I'm fine. I don't need to see this. I swear. Uh, dude, no. Did you just? What just happened? Oh, I should have waited. I'm a dumbass. Our lines are just spinning. I know about the. I know about the uh, where you have to like weight these the scales. You have to like balance out the scales. I know about that one. That mechanic. That is gonna be fun. Imagine, imagine the whole alliance range just spinning. Yeah, I see you. What did we get? Oh, this one again. It looks so nice. It does look really nice. Wait. Um. You're practicing your rotation? I am. I'm practicing everything. I'm practicing playing on this class in general. Um, forget about that mechanic right now where you're spoiling yourself. That is, that is all I know about that. I mean, I know the song too, and I know what the boss looks like. So, mm. yeah, I know it's the thing you're using, Ryuji. I want to take a picture. I don't know if I want to take a picture. I'm so lazy. Mm. It does look really nice though. I want to look at the... I think I've seen the gear and I was like, damn, that looks really cool. But then I didn't like, I didn't know where it was from. My weapon, I have to just stand normally. My weapon doesn't fit my glam and that is the most triggering thing ever. So I'm not going to do that. Um, you do this. You spend me right round, yeah. This is good. Why is everyone- Okay, I have a question. Why is suddenly everyone running- Why is every- Oh my god, I can't even speak anymore. Why is everyone suddenly, like, doing this? Why am I seeing this all the time now? This is the third person I see with that in like the span of two weeks and before I've never seen this weapon ever and now everyone's just... Everyone's just getting that, I guess. Also, what is the lighting in here? Jesus Christ. Can I... Can I tone that down a little bit? My goodness. Um... Maybe it's just confirmation bias. Maybe I've seen it before and now it's just confirmation bias because I have no idea what I'm talking about. Is it from Alexander? No, that is the, uh, this is the, uh, uh, anima relic weapon, if I... Or maybe I'm just dumb. Oh no, it is, okay. Yeah. Um, where's my, where's my stickers? Yeah, it is easy to get. Yeah, definitely. I need you. 
Am I- who am I targeting? This is cute, I guess. I don't know. Oh, wait. I don't like the lighting in here, though. Also, Yumi, you're too much on the side. You need to, like, come closer. Are you scared of me? Am I stinky? Is that what it is? Huh? Is that what it is? No, apparently not. Mmm. It's been in my glam for years. I, uh, something is happening in the universe for people to, to use it. You are stinky? No, you. No, you. You're a dragoon. Dragoons are, dragoons are known to be stinky, are they not? It's, Estinian is. Mm hmm. Alright, let's see what this is all about. You smell like scales now? What the fuck do scales smell like? What have we here? Tis not unlike a Hanish alchemical furnace in design. Well, there is one way we might find out. Stop! You mustn't touch it. What the heck? Why are you here? Vritra! Oh, my apologies. Should I continue calling you Varshan? Estinia has the most change of clothes from all the signs. Uh, I think they also- didn't they also like, I don't know, have- it, Didn't they also like mention that he bathes or something or show that somewhere in like a comic or whatever? I don't remember exactly. But wasn't that also a thing because they wanted- they, 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 they really do not want people to think Estinia is stinky. You may address me as you wish. My nature is no longer a secret. Still, this is not a setting I imagined for our reunion. Surely you've not entered these ruins as common looters. Would that we could deny your accusations, but I fear you're not far from the truth. Great Vritra, might we beseech thee to explain the nature of this strange contrivance? It was crafted by our alchemists at my behest for the purpose of sealing something away. Oh no! <laughs> Whatever could that be? Sealing away, uh, blah, blah, blah. sealing away what exactly? Um, I wasn't going to touch it, but you know we should not <laughs> Sealing what away? I'm curious. Perhaps I should simply show you. Oh, please. I love his accent, it's so cute. It is. It's very nice that they're like, you know, they're keeping in mind the regional things and things like accents. And like the accuracy of the depiction of like a group of people. Oh my god, what is that? That's soup! Oh my god, no, what is that? What is that? What the fuck? Oh, she knows. <laughs> she knows what it I is. I have lifted the seal, if only for the moment, by an authority only I possess. A plainer fisher? No, my friend. Small though it may be, this is a functioning gate into the void. <gasps> Why is that here? That shouldn't be here? Uh, anyway, people joked a lot he didn't bathe because he had Nidhogg's blood in his armor for so long, but that is like a different thing, right? It's just, um... It's like, uh, 
I thought it like fused with this armor or something. I don't know. I didn't take it literally as as that being blood because it like dyed the whole armor weirdly, right? Forbidden grape soon. <laughs> soup. Uh, yes, they, it's a good, it's a good as coaches are being placed in the game. The world building so people all over the world can find comfort and belonging in the game. That is true. I think there's there's uh, there's something for everyone in this game. It's um, it's a good game, okay? What can what can we say, right? It's a good game. Uh, void gates and uh, fishers, uh, fishers, fishers. <laughs> I am much the same thing in practice and in sense. Uh, in a sense that both allow passage between the source and the thirteenth. The difference in terminology refers to the circumstance of their creation. A fisher... I don't have to say that. Isn't... He, I know he just said it. I know he literally just said it in a cutscene, but I forgot. Is an incidental tear in the fabric between worlds, whereas a void gate is the product of deliberate action. I suspect this is the latter, judging by the elaborate mechanism put in place to control it. To think that our search for material riches would lead to this priceless discovery. That swirling empti emptiness it puts in mind of old friends. It puts me in mind of old friends, not to mention old foes. Mm, okay. Fisher. Yeah, Fisher. You may now enter. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, whatever. Where's my quest? Uh, there it is. This is the quest that I need to have done for Alliance Raid. Uh, a brother's grief. Ishtal is appraising the Void Gate with a scholarly eye. I was told the quest name for that. <gasps> Heaven Sword music. I must admit, I am deathly curious to know how a Void Gate came to be hidden in the depths of these ruins. To tell that tale, we must first peer far to the south, and even further into memory. An age five millennia past, when the Algan Empire sent an invading force to the shores of Merasidia, the southern people rallied around the commanding figures of Bahamut and Tiamat, and fought fiercely to repel the would-be conquerors. With Bahamas oh, defeat, shit. however, the tide turned against them. Desperate to seize any advantage, the Mercidians resorted to summoning primal entities. In response, Emperor Zande forged a covenant with the Cloud of Darkness, sovereign among the all-devouring denizens of the Void. Thus bolstered by icons on one side and void scent on the other, the two armies clashed in a battle of unspeakable carnage. So much death, so much loss. I consider myself well versed in that period of history, yet you speak as one who witnessed it happen. Indeed, I did. I heard Tiamat's roar of defiance and sped toward that war-torn land. Along with my sibling, Ashdaya. We dragons are not male or female, as men are wont to classify, but Elder Sister is the closest a mortal tongue can come to describing what she meant to me. I was the last of our brood to hatch, and Ashdaya cared for me where my sire could not. Thus, I was with her when Tiamat roared. I was with her when she journeyed south, and I was with her when she fought against the void sent hordes. Yet no matter how many of their vile fiends we cast down, more rose from the abyss to take their place. Faced with an unwinnable war of attrition, Ashdaya risked her all on a final gamble. Yeah, Lemon, uh, completely understandable. I'm so happy your Pop-Tarts are here, actually. Uh, 
Who cares about who cares about the story really? Honestly. <laughs> she plunged through oh, the damn. void gate itself to strike at the root of their strength. Okay, and some for some reason the crystal tower's there. All right. Mm -hmm. I mean, I know that's where the raid is. I tried so. to follow in her wake, determined to lend what aid I could. But even as I came upon Alag's glittering tower, I saw the rift close behind her. Oh, I see. And Ashdaya has been lost to us ever since. I find I must retract my earlier claim of historical knowledge. Nowhere in the Crystal Tower's archives did I see mention of such noble sacrifice. That does not surprise me. To Alagan eyes, it must have seemed as if a lone dragon, driven to madness, simply dove through the gate and did not return. For my part, I spent long years searching for the means to reunite with Ashdaya. Until I could search no more, until Alag was dust, and the arts to open a void gate large enough to accommodate a dragon forever lost. Yet you have the beginnings of a gate right here, under the control of a harnessed device. My discovery came before Radzat Han was founded. Though I scoured the lands for a method to cross the rift, it was beneath the sea that I chanced to find a natural plane of fissure. It was, however, far too narrow to admit a worm's bulk. Only after our city rose upon the rock, and I could enlist the aid of our talented alchemists, did matters take a favorable turn. Their dedication was beyond reproach. Tirelessly they worked to expand the fissure, and after decades of toil, it finally grew to a size that a child might pass through. Not long ago, you told us that you called out to your kin, that Ashdaya's answer was silence. I suspect the conclusion to your tale is not a joyful one. With hope in my heart, I used a simulacrum to cross the threshold. But no, I did not find her. What I found was a host of void scent clamoring around the opening they had sensed. It was but a moment, but enough. I had no choice but to retreat and allow the portal to contract once more. The gate was a threat to your people. You had to decide between endangering Razat Han and abandoning your sister. And you chose the latter. It was not that thy siblings scorned thy call. Was that she was trapped beyond a barrier through which neither roar nor dragon may pass. Even now, in the desolate world of the Thirteenth. I can scarce imagine your pain, yet it was wise not to linger in that place. Too long a sojourn, and even a being of your power risks being warped into a creature of the Void. You've seen this phenomenon before. When we stepped into the darkness. Um, I thought our time had come. I remember when Nero turned purple. <laughs> uh, uh, yeah. Okay. <laughs> that was something. As did I. Were it not for Une and Doga, or Nero, for that matter, we might never have made it home. Hmm. Do you remember what happened to Nero? How his wounds allowed the Void's corruption to enter his body and twist his ether? Had it been allowed to progress much longer, I presume he would have been fully transformed. Then there is little hope for Ashdaya. Ah, no. I hadn't meant to. I speak only of possibilities. The scales of the first brood are extraordinarily resistant to ethereal fluctuations. They are the protective talisman's core components, after all, and even the corruption I described would struggle to overcome. Of course.
course. With the warding scale in one's possession, one could conceivably survive a stay in the 13th without being warped by its energies. Be that as it may, it is too late to rescue my sister. Five thousand years too late. And now countless others look to me for guidance and protection. Then we go home and chill. So when I sensed intruders in the ruins, I came only to ensure that the gate remained closed. That, and to secure the treasure, of course. I wish only to forget the rest. feeling that they're not you know I have a feeling that we're gonna be dealing with that it's just a hunch you know that she's not actually dead or we're gonna go looking for her maybe perhaps who knows uh, so they managed to not not only to expand the fissure but also manipulate it as one mighty gate Astonishing. Is there any chance I could learn more of how this feat was accomplished? I will tell you what I can. First, however, I must return to the High Crucible and arrange to replace the guardians you so handily destroyed. It will not do to leave the gate undefended. Ah, my apologies. We were perhaps a touch zealous in our rush to uncover the vault's secrets. If the constructs can be repaired, we would be happy to offer assistance. That will not be necessary. As much as I retain spar spare vessels for myself, we keep duplicate guardians on hand for such eventualities. In any case, we should return to Radzat Han. Hmm. Um, never had a pop tart before, me neither. Can they barely sell them here? Yeah. I heard pop tarts are sugary death. They are. They are. Yep. Look at the quest name. Yeah, I know it's the. I saw it's the quest for. For the alliance raid. Mm -hmm. I have a prediction that the sister will either be hot or evil or both. You think so? I think it's gonna be a. Uh, I think it's gonna be a dragon, though. No? I think it's gonna be a human form. How much sense would that make? I think it's uh, it it would be a dragon. Right? I don't see about this. I promise we will discuss the void gate further, but first I must attend to the matter of the vault's sentinels. As your instruments have no doubt informed you, the Kapikulu has been reduced to so much scrap. Please bring a new one out of the storage and see that it is conveyed to its post along with some few lesser constructs. Was it tomb robbers? Fre fiends born from the Tower of Zod by the sisters. Do not tell me a blasphemy yet roams free. Um. <laughs> it wasn't us. No, no, it wasn't. No, no, no. Why such guilty faces? Surely it isn't you who are responsible for this. Oh. Uh, well, the details aren't important. I shall see it done immediately. And with that, the vault will soon be secure once more. Now, I believe you had questions. 
Quite a few, in fact, but I'd like to begin with the gate itself. It is still functional, yes? Indeed, which is why I saw it sealed with an alchemically forged lock and awarded it with ma my magics, so its power must not fall into the wrong hands. In truth, the primary reason for the vault's construction was to keep the gate hidden from the outside world. So much effort for su such a little door. That little door you speak of leads to an abyss teeming with unspeakable horrors. That said, it is cur in its current state, it would admit only the lo lowliest of void sand, and from this side, no man would be able to pass through. No man, I should think Elfino would fit, given a firm enough push. Estinian, why are you so mean? Physical size is only one consideration. The true restriction hinges upon the etheric density of the soul in transit. And yet you succeeded in expanding this diminutive portal and sending your simulacrum to the 13th. Thanks to my brilliant alchemists, I, sh I should have destroyed the anomaly when I found it, but instead I bade them devise a means to control it. After much experimentation, they accomplished the impossible. A method was conceived by which my magics could manipulate the fissure and transform it into a serviceable gate. But the process has long since been forgotten. Once I had given up searching for as uh, 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 Ashdaya, right? Ashdaya? Ashdaya, uh, there was no need to preserve such esoteric and dangerous knowledge. Thus has the gate lain dormant for years uncounted. Our own passage to the 13th was made relatively simple thanks to the Crystal Tower. An ancient mechanism channeled the tower's vast stores of energy to open a void gate, one bound to a covenant made with the Cloud of Darkness. Once that sovereign entity was beaten back, however, the covenant was broken, and the doorway severed from its connection to the void. Theoretically, it should be possible to reconnect a gate by forging a new pact with another void sand, but such deals usually, deals usually end in betrayal and death. In any case, we should attempt to gain an understanding of the Bounty Gate. Mayhap you could resume the search for your sister. As I have already explained, I put those futile hopes to rest centuries ago. My place and my duty is here now. Ah, I had meant to ask, what prompted you to search for the vault in the first place? Um, it was Alistinian's idea. It was Alistinian's idea. I have nothing to do with this. This is not my fault. Uh, good night, MBG. Good night, good night. Thank you for hanging out with us. Stay safe out there. Stay hydrated. Sleep well. Um, <laughs> we would never know. We would never get into trouble. We would never do anything. No, 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 no. I won't stop people from think finding a a a Ashdaya hot. True. True. Yeah. Um. He's dating his mom. He thinks it's okay to make fun of him now. Who? What? What am I experiencing? What? What? Huh? Huh? Throwing a Stinian under the bus? I will always. Every single time. As I recall, it was you who was chasing tales of undersea ruins. Well, as you have seen, the fabulous wealth of the stories is quite real, if not its rumored origin. But I'm afraid I must assert a prior claim. I've been adding to that trove for years, little by little, but time has come to spend it, that I might alleviate my people's suffering. Then we are of one mind. We had no intention of taking it for ourselves. Isn't that right, my friend? <laughs> I would never. It's like you wanted to steal it. I know you did. Your Excellency, would you object if I were to conduct a closer examination of the gate? I will make no attempt to open it, of course. I owe you and yours a debt that can never be repaid. Whatever boon you ask of me, you shall have it. You are most gracious. I shall take full advantage of your permission. What did I could join thee and I study, but the Lopperitz will be anxious to receive my report. I beg my leave of you. And I must be off to Charlien as well. Mistress Krell was eager to speak with you about that request, so please come back to the Annex as soon as you are able. Farewell for now. Uh, you can be sure I will, Graha. I. No hesitation. We can discuss my findings once I return. You'll not be rid of me so easily.
Estenin is dating Elf. Oh, I see. Okay. No, he's not. You may now undertake the Chronicles of a New Era quest series, Myths of the Realm. There it fucking is. Speak with a fresh faced student at the Baldessian Annex to accept the first quest. <gasps> Damn. Alright, let me complete this. Um. Grumpy Jumpy? <laughs> what kind of name is that? Oh my god. Um. The difficult part in all this will be deciding how best to put these riches to use. Will you lend me your assistance in these deliberations? Uh, of course. Thank you, Sake. Sakai and I are in this together. I will follow her example. Aww. Estinian. Estinian wanted to run from Elfie's mom. Yeah, I mean, I don't think they're dating, I think. I think, y meanwhile, elsewhere. I like that. I think everyone. What is happening? What the fuck am I looking at? What are these, like, places in the middle of nowhere where it's just, like, in the void? Please. It, it, uh, if he's hot, I swear. Is it chaos? What the fuck is going on? Oh my god. Okay. Uh, I sensed the breaching of a gate, but it was not instigated from this side. It was thrown open from the other. I too felt it. A rare occurrence, yes, but such a tiny portal is beneath our notice. There are more pressing matters at hand. An opportunity is upon us. The coming of which we have awaited for nigh on 10,000 years. We dare not let it slip our grasp. Oh, this is cool. <gasps> Yet we must not underestimate she who bested the cloud of darkness. Even restrained by a covenant, the cloud was no feeble wisp to be dispersed by some flesh and blood mortal. But let her come. I will drown the world and watch this fleshling gasp for breath in her final moments. Oh shit, what is happening? Your zeal is admirable, but forget not our cause. Think back on our struggles beneath the sunless sky. Remember why we seed, not our will to fight. This time we set the war in motion and win redemption for our star. Oh shit. Oh great, back to the- oh yeah! Back to the, you know, back to the cheery music, we're fine. Everything is fine, we're good, nothing is happening, my goodness. Uh, Estinia has always been the dragoon, the man going on the hunts, a million scaring him, gives him the fresh breath of, breath of air he needs. I mean, if you want to put it like that, sure, feel free to, that, you know, you can have any headcanon you want. I'm not gonna judge. Um, sharing the wealth. Varshan, Varshan uh, wishes to discuss the distribution of the treasure. I'm just gonna accept this and then I think I'll look into the Yen Lines raid. Shall we begin? If we are to spend the treasure wisely, then we must first determine which groups would benefit most from monetary assistance. Some of my citizens may find it intimidating to speak with the Satrap directly, so I would ask that you act in my stead. Saka, you are to visit Akiali and Yedlimod. Speak with Matsya and his people and listen to their grievances. Estinian, I bid you do the same at Pelikistan. I will be conducting my own inquiries at the giant, giant scale grounds. 
Once you believe you have ascertained the needs of the populace, populace, we can reconvene at Mega Megaduta. Alright, uh, okay. Uh, what did they say? Baldessian Bild Annex, right? So I can just go to Shalian and figure that out. It's Thordan's dad. Don't don't drag Thordan into here, please. This is not this is not the place or time for that, please. Um Where is that? Here? Oh yeah. Um I shall unlock it. We can do it today and I will be probably annihilated. Ooh. A mission in Mordona. A fresh faced student's face lights up at the sight of you. Ah, Sake, welcome back. Are you perchance here to see Kral? I'm given to understand she has a task for which she desires your assistance. Uh, I think, yeah, I think I'm just gonna do this now and then do I continue my request uh, at another time next week? Yes, yes, yes. Um, then I shall fetch her at once. Pray, wait a moment. Sakai, my thanks for coming. If you're now available, I'd like you and Raha to assist me in a task I had mentioned. For you to call on Sakai, I assume the task in question is somewhat more exciting than sorting through paperwork, which I'm pleased to add I have finished. So if Sakai is ready, then so am I. Our venture to the bounty has only served to whet my appetite for field work. Not to oversell things, but I suspect you won't be disappointed. You are divulged the details, however. Permit me to provide some background. As you know, our organization, the Students of Baldassian, was founded by my grandfather, Galif. Our stated mission was to uncover the mysteries of Heidelin and interpret her will, particularly through the study to, of her gift to us. We've since learned the whole truth, and it might be said that we've fulfilled our mission, but our work is far from over. In the course of our endeavors, we've also sought to devise countermeasures against threats that come to light. Our involvement with the Warring Triad is an example of such. It's my belief that, in continuing to seek out the, the unknown and dealing with threats, we best carry on the student's mission. We best honor those we lost when the Isle of Val was destroyed. Forgive me, I didn't mean to darken the mood. In saying all this, I simply wanted to clarify our organization's purpose for a new age. In line with said purpose, I've been reviewing new requests, and one in particular jumped out at me. It comes from none other than Rambrose, of the son of Saint Cunage. Cunage, Cunage, Cunage? Truly, has something happened in Mordona then? So it would seem, and he wishes to entrust the matter to us. While his missive is on, sparse on details, he. I, I read parse. Like, my brain- well, my brain is dead. Um, he writes what that it lies beyond the sun's expertise. Uncharted territory are the exa exact words he used. I'd like you to meet with Rambrose and conduct a preliminary survey. What say you? Pretty much done with main story quest now. Also, oh, little Terry! Hello! <laughs> Uh, it's just running around and talking to a few people. Yeah, I would assume so. Um, made so request is made so request. Uh, I could finish it, but I don't know. I don't know how long this takes, we're just gonna see. Wonderful, when you're ready, pray make your way to Revenant's Tall. I shall let Rambrose know you to receive you there. I must remain here to oversee our operations, but should it transpire that more hands are needed, don't hesitate to send word. Well, there's no time like the present. If you could go on ahead to Revenant's Tall, I shall make ready and then be on my way. Maybe it would be better to finish Main Story Quest though, if there's not like much left. But I don't know how long it, it'll take. If it takes like, I don't know, two hours, it's a fine, but... Um some really cool bits left. You even get a little quote screen when you're actually done with the patch. Mm. I think we can do that another day, though. 
nice outfits. Can I, what if I, okay, so what if I glam this to the thing? Where is it? It's probably gonna look so weird. Yeah, I need to like, um, what is happening here? The gloves, I swear to God. What if we do this and then I do this? I guess that works. Yeah, that works. Um, where do I go? Wait, um, Mordona. Four to five hours? It, ta it, 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 it takes four to five hours in general, not like what I have left, right? <laughs> that would be uh, quite, quite the thing. Oh my god, I need to turn off targeting myself. I thought that was a good idea and then I realize it's not. There you are, Sake. It would seem we're early. My apologies for the wait. Rambros, what a pleasure to see you again. How have you been? The pleasure is all mine, my friend. I've been well, and it gladdens me to see that you are too. Now, I know you have many demands upon your time, so I shall explain the particulars of our request at once. Recently, an explorer came to us who claimed to have discovered the Phantom Realm. The Phantom Realm, so this is what you meant by uncharted territory. You're not familiar, perhaps unsurprising given that it is a lesser known legend. The legend hold, holds that across Eorzea there exists a realm that appears as a mirage. Though visible from a distance, it fades away as one draws near. While it has featured in it was it has featured in myths since ancient times, the realm's existence could not be proven, and thus it is seldom mentioned in liter literature. In spite of this, fueled by rumors of the occasional sighting, the myth has persisted and continues to capture the hearts and minds of explorers. Mia, hello! Mia, how are you doing? How's it going? Let me... Mia, let me do this. Let me do this. T take a shout out and everyone go over and go perceive Mia. I don't know what you're doing at the moment, Mia, but whatever you're doing, it, it's probably great. <laughs> uh, that you yourself would, should reach out to us. Is it real then? When first the explorer in question approached us, we doubted him, but we couldn't doubt the evidence of our senses. Nay, the realm is real, as you will soon, soon see for yourselves. Good gods, a part of me still struggles to believe it, but we have no reason to doubt you. Suffice it to say, we are eager to see the realm too. Yeah, I hope you're feeling better, Mia. I saw you posted that you weren't feeling well. Couldn't stream. Mm, I did prog morph the new ultimate today, but I'm also ill. Oh, you need to take care of yourself. Take care of yourself. Health comes first. Health then ultimates. I swear. Mia is my favorite Lala after calling my cat boy hot. <laughs> what the fuck? What went on between you guys, huh? What? What? What did? What were you? What? 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 Um, interesting. Uh, whatever truth awaits, I pray you will succeed in finding it. Seek out the explorer, one Derek. He has seen more of the realm than us and should be willing to serve as your guide. I asked him to accompany me here, but he preferred to continue exploring on his own. He will be somewhere near the banks of Silver Tear Lake, I expect. Understood. Our thanks, Rambros. I 
I went to visit Mia during stream. Ah, I see. Okay. Uh, come, let us split up and look for our explorer. Let's be honest, a lot goes on whenever Mia is around. That is true. That is very true. Yeah. Um. Off we go. Distance. What are you guys doing, huh? Get in here. Oh, lies? No, 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 no. Yeah, you, you can't get out of this. Everyone here knows. Everyone here knows. Everyone was here. Everyone was here when it all escalated. Uh, everyone was here. Yuji, stop sending me towels. You're scaring my. You're scaring me. The explorer doesn't appear to be in the area. Okay. Anyway, what is that? Why is there a monkey here? You see a small oppo oppo. It couldn't possibly be the explorer, or could it? Huh? I swear to God, what is going on? Just in case you weren't, you were entertaining the thought, Sake, that Opa Opo is it our explorer. I have the man in question here with me. I was unsure for a second. I'm so happy I changed glam. He stole my glam. What the fuck? You stole my outfit, bro. Aww. I forgive you. Your monkey is really cute. Uh, I'm Derek, the one who discovered the Phantom Realm. My apologies for making you search for me. Aww. Curious about this creature, are you? I found him injured during one of my journeys and tended to him. Since then, he has taken to following me around. He's inquisitive, but otherwise harmless, so pray him no pay him no mind. Aww. You're the hero who delivered our star from doom, are you not? What good fortune that one as capable as you should lend her aid. To be clear, our, our organization has yet to accept a commission. Before we can make a decision, we, could con we would conduct a preliminary survey. Will you guide us to the Phantom Realm? Of course, I will show you to the entrance at once. The gate to the realm, to a realm long dreamed of by explorers. He did steal my glam, yes. He did, uh, and he did not have the outfit longer than me. I just met this guy. Probably has had it, oh, he probably has had it since two days, I don't know. What are you? Oh shit, what the fuck? Huh? What is going on? Impressive, isn't it? When a gate manifested, so too did this magic, allowing one to thus walk upon water. Are you sure you're not a very significant uh, person? Huh? Are you sure it's safe? This is just like Oriage's spell. This is just like Oriage's spell. You're Jesus. Someone conceived the means to do this at will. An intriguing individual. It's perfectly safe, I assure you. Come. I don't trust this man. Okay. It, he just... He just leaves like that. It's easy like... Okay. Whatever you say. Whatever you say, game, it's fine. By the twelfth, you truly can walk here. What magic is this? By what means is it perpetuated? 
forgive me. Let us continue on. We're just leaving like- it's just easy like that. I'm so confused. <laughs> Everything is so confusing. Uh, what is happening? Oh, wow. It's Elpis, but brighter. This is the Phantom Realm. Think that the entrance would lie over Silver Tear Lake. And hello, Jay. Hello. If you uh, if you want to see if you want to see a cute angel VTuber that fits the theme of this area very well, <laughs> what am I saying? Please go check out Jay. Also, no, you're so pretty. Woo. Uh, Spirit just flashbanged me. That wasn't me. That was a game that I have no control. I'm also getting. You have to imagine. I'm also getting flashbang. G post stream. I mean, I would do that, but I know that's not a. Uh, it's, I shouldn't. <laughs> um. Looking forward to tomorrow. Me and Mio going to, going to the aquarium. Then gonna have a barbecue. <gasps> can I? Can I join? Can I join? <laughs> can I be the? Can I be the can I be the tour guide or something? Hmm? Um How's Final Fantasy XIV going? Good! I'm looking at Graha a lot today, so that is really nice. I love this man. So <laughs> So yeah. Um but also we're doing we're doing 6.1 stories, so the newest story, and we're doing the newest like content, which I'm really happy about, so now I can join people in doing that. So yeah. Um also, Fran knows Blackfire? Huh? I see. You can come? Yes. Thank you. Very nice. I'm canceling all streams tomorrow, guys. I need to go. I need to go, go with them. Yes, yes. Um, there's nothing out of the ordinary with the environment. The sights, the sounds, the smells all appear to, as they should be in nature. That is to say, this place is no illusion. Did you know Blackfire Artist was in my old FC and I've known him for like ages? Really? The world is so small. What the heck? That's so cool. I bid you welcome to the navel of the phantom realm, the Amphalus. Hmm. Oh, I like the music. Um. The Amphalus, you say this place is called? Um, Saka is the best thing you did while coming here, and no, you, shh. Shh. Hey, come on now. Saka is part of the stream. Yes, I am part of the Whiskers. Uh, amazing group of Final Fantasy XIV focused streamers. You should totally check them out. They're like down below somewhere. If you're on, uh, if you're on mobile, I don't know where they are, but they're somewhere down there, probably. And if you're on desktop, they're like right next to my name. Like right underneath next to my name. Mm -hmm. Mm. 
What? Sometimes Sega also uses whiskers on stream. True, I do. Sometimes I turn into a cat girl. It's amazing. I can just do that. It's, uh, it's magic. Um, I'm phallus. Yes. In name of my own conception, I confess, I felt we needed something to call it by. Lest you wonder, the word means navel in an ancient tongue. An allusion to Mordona's location in the heart of Aldenard. Huh? As you can see, there are man-made structures, and the place appears well-kept, yet there isn't a single soul in evidence. Tis my hope that you will help me to shed light upon this realm, to- I think there's a lot of light here, but okay. To learn who created it, and to what end. I should also like to know why it has revealed itself now. Was it simply chance that kept it hidden, or something more? In any case, let us begin by taking a look around. Whiskers! Yes, whiskers! Whiskers good. Mm -hmm. When I can visit Saka and my main, I'd love to do in-game things with her. That sounds so dirty, did it? I think you're just interpreting things into your own sentence there. Is this an etherite? Uh, also me invite. Um, where is... The stone monument has been erected here, by whose hand you cannot say, but the motives wrought into its base appear familiar. Yeah, a little bit, just a little bit. This is my, this is mine. This is my god. He belongs to me. Um... Where am I supposed to go? But yeah, I'm excited. I'm excited for um, for data center travel, and I'm also excited for the 400 new glam dresser spots we are hopefully getting very soon. Cries a little bit because I've been needing these very much. <gasps> see the crystal tower is here. I can see it. <gasps> it's here. I see it. In the distance, you see, yeah, you see what appears to be the crystal tower. Though the clouds make it difficult to be sure, it would seem that you're in the sky above Silver Tier Lake. No such isle could be seen from the outside, however. <gasps> Damn. Best God, yes, yes indeed. I take no. Uh, I think all my characters have different gods, actually. All my fifteen alls that I have. But this is obviously the best one. Beardy suspicious user again? It didn't it didn't tell me that. So it didn't tell me that this time. I think Twitch is just bugging out a little bit. I'm not sure what's happening, but thank you for the hydrate. I'll hydrate Ryuji. Um Taliak is mine. I don't yeah. Not not a good one though, sorry. Sorry. Mmm. Goes great with the many glam plates we have. We will never have enough glam plates. They could add another 10 and it wouldn't be enough. Like, I thought, oh, five is so good, right? I think everyone thought this. I think everyone was like, oh, five more glam plates, that is so good. And then you filled them instantly and now you're like, I, I don't know what to do with my glams. I have too many glams. I have no, not enough space. And it's just like, how did we ever live with five less? What the fuck? Right? It's terrible. I've ran out of room, I have to keep switching items out. Yeah, I feel that so much. You have no idea. I like, I threw away 20 items and I was like, oh, 20 items, that is a lot. I will not fill that space anytime soon, probably. And then literally 10 minutes after, I filled all the spots with glams. And I was like, wow, that was not, that was, uh, that did not, that did not last a long time. So, yeah. Um... Mm. You can see the lava dome looking thing that's part of the binding coil here? What? Where? What? What? Really? I need to like explore this place, but... Ha uh ha! -huh. Yo, Boba seems quite at home, wouldn't you say? How many times has Derek come here, I wonder? Where is it? I don't know what you're talking about, Graha. Are you calling me a monkey, Graha? Is that what she's doing? Um... I need 40? Yeah, same. 
Back in Stormblood, they promised us a third free retainer, so where's that? Yeah, what the fuck? Hello? I didn't even know about that. I didn't play in- I mean, I did play in Stormblood. That was literally when I started playing for the first time, but I didn't play much. I had no idea what was going on in the game, so... Uh, I was like, it's not like I'm using them all, so it's all good, and then not 20 minutes after all the extra plays were full. Yeah, I know. That was exactly what it was like for me, too. Uh, hilariously, the patron gods in lore are usually prayed to by specific races and use specific classes, but I'm willing to bet when people chose their gods, their race, their main class, do not consi uh, coincide with lore. How many players' gods are Volga, but not monk mains? Uh, Ikusa, I actually started as a monk main. Uh, because I... I did that. I actually started as a monk on this character. Uh, so I did I did what I was supposed to do. What can I say? I just stopped playing it at like level 60. <laughs> but I did start. And it was really cool because then like your your quest make your quest line makes so much sense, right? Like it's so much cooler when it's actually like people are talking about Ralga and uh, you know it's it's cool and you're like, oh yeah, that is my deity, yeah, you know? That was nice. Um, together with more spearfish harpoons and being able to glam Monaco, but I kind of forgot about her. I know people have been com people have been complaining about that. I have experienced that. Yes. Mm -hmm. Uh, most of my characters are just on the Azema. Uh, I think so. For me, I've really I've been choosing a lot of different ones because I don't know. I just feel like it adds to the, it. There's no use, right? But it adds to the character. And I have a lot of different characters with lots of different personalities. And I'm kind of like a roleplay person where I want them to like. I want everything to like fit together. And uh, I think I've chosen like all of them. But I don't know. It's um. I don't know. I couldn't tell you who I used on what character and what they're like. I don't know what their personality is like. I would have to look that up. But I know my I know my little lizard here has Ralga. <laughs> <laughs> Which is cool. Uh, it's a lizard of destruction, yeah. Mm -hmm. Uh, hello Ruby! Sake got wings, Sake is a sin eater. Yeah! Mm-hmm. Uh, I am. Is there a problem with that? Or... Is that bad? I'm not gonna... I'm not gonna, like, kill you. You know? I kind of need you here, so... I remember starting as Black Mage and straight up when I was max level wanting to go into Savage until now I never got the chance to. Aww. Aww. Um, that's how I do with my characters I create with a role playing perspective. Yes, mm hmm. And headcan that fits, fits the lore. Yes, I feel that. Um. I haven't been here in a long time. Yeah, I, I'm noticing. You realize that you, like. Uh, it's uh, realizing that I have wings. I have had those for a bit, so I noticed. We've been trying to contact you regarding your Chocobo's extended warranty. You may be eligible to now coming bombing damages. Uh, what did- what would they- d What? What? What do you mean bombing damages to my Chocobo? I am absolutely scared. I'm very scared. Uh... You got me on you starting Monk for Raga, but do you, uh, you don't identify as El Amiga? No, I do not. I do not. That is, that is right. That is the, that is the extent. Um, a number of structures such as this can be seen in the area. What purpose could they possibly serve? The architecture is unlike anything I've seen in Eorzea. Truly exquisite stuff. Okay. Okay. Um, psychological damages? I mean, yeah, I guess if you look, like, if you look at what's going on there, sure. Hello, Sella! How are you doing? How's it going? Finished looking around, have you? What are your impressions? We have done, uh, we have had only a cursory glance, but this is a truly mysterious place. The gleaming spire rising beyond the clouds, that is most certainly the crystal tower. And judging by its aspect, we are a considerable distance above Silver Tear Lake, which would suggest the gate we entered is a teleporter. However, if this isle lies where it appears to be, to lie, then it couldn't have escaped the battle of Silver Tear's skies unscathed. 
which is to say we are in Mordona, and yet we are not. Tis as if we were displ displaced from our world, if only slightly. This place is an ab way to put it. Was there aught else you noticed? Aye, the motives upon yonder structure, they are unmistakably the marks of the twelfth. By which I posit that this was created to be a place of worship. But by whom? I cannot think of any who could have possibly built such grand premises, never mind magically conceal it, at, le at least not in the wake of the Battle of Silver Tear Skies. Aye, this is a mysterious place indeed. Okay. Mm, there is a connection with Almigo, but there are Ralgar's worshipper. Uh, they are not only there. Yeah, it's just spread out. It's, I, I don't know. I don't think we should take it too seriously. <laughs> uh, good and super happy you finally clicked P to us. <gasps> That is nice, that's very nice. Congratulations. Now off to P3S. How do you feel about it? Huh? Are you looking forward to it? <laughs> um, Battle of Silver Tears, guys, 1.0 inter cinematic. Yeah, I'm, yeah, I'm aware. The realm of the gods, Grahatias, pondering how best to proceed. It has been a while, it has indeed. But I like recently, I actually recently watched that cinematic. Well, it seems there is but one solution for our ignorance, a thorough investigation. For this we will require more manpower and supplies, among other things. With your permission, we will confer with our representative, Kryl, and make the necessary arrangement, arrangements for a formal investigation. If that is what must be done to commence your work in earnest, then by all means. Without further ado, let us return to Charlian. Hold, mortals. Oh no! Is that a god talking to us? Oh my god, I think we're in trouble. Oh god, I think we're in trouble. <laughs> You profane the sacred realm with your very presence and must answer for your irreverence. Oh my god. Oh my god. I didn't think they would just be here. Okay. <laughs> Wait, I, it seems we're in trouble. <laughs> I'm very god the builder. Oh god. Very god. Then the 12 are real. I don't even know how to say his name, I'm sorry. Bye. That's my god, dude. He looks like a Giga Chad. Where am I? Where are the where where are the Giga Chad? Where are the Giga Chad emotes? I'm so disappointed in you. Where's the Twitch Chad hive mind? Let there be no doubt, we are not Simulacra, born of mortal faith. Nay, the Twelve for divinity is true. And in Heidelin's absence, we are the star's rightful rulers. It's well. Closely have we watched mankind. And we have determined that you, champion of Heidelin, pose a threat to our ascension. You were foolish to wander into our realm. We could destroy you with ease here and now, but as divinities we must demonstrate grace and forbe forbearance. 
There is but one pa path. We must weigh this mortal's worth. Here, here, let there be a trial. Huh, while the mortal would invariably be destroyed, it would at least provide us with a diversion. What, you suddenly appear and expect us to simply comply with your whims? Protest if you wish, but mortal logic means not to gods. You will abide by our laws. Lo, the gateway to our sanctum sanctums lies open. Show us the strength of mankind. Show us the honor of mankind. Show us the spirit of mankind. If man would remain the master of his own destiny, then as assemble your comrades and come. Come and prove your worthiness. I'm so confused. <laughs> chill we're just going in there and we're gonna slap them it's gonna be fine seven hells during my previous forays nothing like this ever happened i encountered not a single soul and certainly not gods and by their own admission they mean to take over the star what are we to do The situation has indeed taken an unexpected turn, but we must try to think clearly. The Twelve have long been rever rever revered and worshipped in Eorzea, and myths about them abound. But to my knowledge, they have never thus appeared so openly before people. For these beings to suddenly reveal themselves, just when we were here, claim supremacy over the star and challenge Sake to trial. Too much about this feels odd and gives me pause. Yeah, this is very, like, casual for them being, like, literally all- I don't know, they're just, like, super powerful gods and they're just like, Yeah, you know what, we could snap you out of existence, but also, we're just gonna invite you to a trial. It's like, what? Fair enough, yet, yet as it stands, it seems we can't dismiss the threat either. Whatever they are, if they're in, is, issuing a challenge, a challenge accepted. Guys from Belsa once said to the 12 2, we're simply primals. <laughs> Dude, I'm gonna do this because this fucking shit, I swear to God. I hate it here. Throwback to Praetorium. He didn't only say it once, is the only thing I'm gonna say. I have heard him say that many, many times, and I've said it myself many, many times. It's true that even Hydaelyn and Zodiac were primals and we cannot discount the possibility, but we know too little to draw conclusions. In any event, if these beings seek dominion over the star, as they say, what happens here may have far-reaching implications. To that end, I believe we should take action. Suffice it to say you are with me. And the students of Badassian will officially tend to the situation. I, in the course of studying the star's mysteries, we have undertaken to deal with any threats that may arise. This is no different. Um, I start with Raga because I counted up to that month where my character character's birthday is, but I changed it to Azema. Oh, I see. Okay. That P1S sign up image, woo meow. I I put so much thought into the sign up images for the raids today. It I I think I had some. I had like a, uh, it like it my my creativity poured out of it, and also my my willingness to attack people personally also did. So that you know that is just a result of that. Right, let us deliberate our course of action. Derek, know you ought of these being sanctums. Aye, there are domains in the Phantom Realm that lie beyond each gate. I've explored them all. 
Perhaps due to etheric instability, there are times when one can enter when ordinarily one cannot, but it would seem the way has been opened for us. While I encountered no gods during my previous forays, I saw enough to know my way around. I am but a humble explorer and, noth and can cannot contend with gods, but if you would be willing to protect me, I will serve as your guide. Assemble your comrades. Birgot Betas. As strong as I know you are, we know little, little and less about our fo foes. I can't speak today. Neither their strength nor their true nature. It would be decidedly reckless to contend with them unprepared. Don't worry, I have people. And so, as much as I would like to accompany you, I shall do what affords us the best chance of victory. While you set forth to answer the gods' challenge, challenge, I will work behind the scenes in my capacity as a student. For one, it would behoove us to arm ourselves with knowledge about the Twelfth, and I shall begin by apprising Kral of the situation. By thus utilizing our resources to the fullest, we shall overcome whatever trials await. Yeah, I really like the song. I wonder what the mail is for? Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. Also, little Flopsy, you can change it. What do you mean you can change it? Oh, you mean a birthday? Yeah, you can if you use a Fantasia. You can, uh... Aglaia, now accessible Pog! Uh, you can change the birthday. You can change your, uh, guardian deity. You can change all of that, yeah. Um... I missed the out. Wonder what the out is for? Uh, yeah. You know, I don't know either. It just came to me. Somehow. Uh, we have one more spot, by the way. If anyone wants to join for the Alliance Raid, we have one more spot open. Um, They didn't lie, the builder is really built. Yeah, he is. Uh, he is a Giga Chad, is what I've been saying. Um, Tsuki wants to join? I can do that. That works. Sending me a tell as well, then. They're on top of it. Um. Oh, Mia, you rest. Mia, you don't get to join us. You need to rest. You're sick. Didn't you say you were sick? You're not even allowed. You're not allowed to join us. I don't allow it today. <laughs> um, did not know that. I never Fantasia. Oh, yeah, yeah. I, I guess you wouldn't know. And usually, I don't think that's what you change. Like, you don't Fanta, I mean, maybe some people, Fanta to change their, I don't know, to ch I, I have Fanta for stupid reasons before, but only once. But, um, yeah, I don't know. Let me do a ready check. Uh, you, we're gonna, we're gonna all die, by the way. This is gonna go, go horribly wrong, but it's okay. Um... Back to the potato field. <laughs> Grow healthy and strong. Exactly. I'm still watching. Got this. Wait, I'm still watching. You can't stop me. I will. It's fine. I will not. Uh, who is. Do, are we good? Is this. I don't know. Mm, he almost got his clear. Must have helped. You? If you don't rest, tell, tell the doctor to use one of those horse syringes. No. Don't do that! Don't do that to Mia! What the fuck? We're not doing that. Meanwhile, me who used the Around Me Born Fanta just to change my cat boy's voice. Yeah, that is what I'm saying. Sometimes you, you use it for, like, weird reasons, right? And I've used it to make my tail thicker. And then I was like, I can't just make my tail thicker. That is a stupid reason to, to use a Fantasia. And then what I did, I slightly changed my face and my eye color. That is what I did with that Fantasia, but yeah, essentially it was a Fantasia to make my tail thicker. So yeah, mm -hmm. that happens. Um, going in there. One of your party members does not uh, meet the requirements. Is that me? Is it item level? No, it can't be. What do you mean one of my, do we have a party? D d is our party setup okay? I think our party setup might not be uh, what it's supposed to be. Or is it? Um, 
Don't inject a lala with ketamine. Uh, no, please. You have a level 50 ring. Oh my god, Ryuji, please fix your fix your gear. Jesus Christ. Also, Naha, how are you doing? Ryuji, just get a new ring. Is it your item level? Just get a new ring. Uh, and yes, I'm Aura again. I'm Aura, yay! I'm happy, very happy. Um, how are you doing, Naha? How's it going? Extra thick tail. I don't have the extra thick one. I just I have the thickest one before you get the really thick one. The the thing I didn't like about the I would totally get it, but like I didn't I don't like that it just like stops at some point and there's like this curve. I'm pretty sure you know what I mean, right? And it just looks weird to me. And I'm pretty sure it wouldn't matter because all the glams, like they don't show that really. But it's just I don't know. It 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 I I don't know. I just I, I this one is fine. This one is nice. Yeah. Um, it's just one tank and two healers. Yeah, that is that is fine. That was fine, but uh, uh, I just thought maybe we didn't have a second healer or something. I don't know, but um, I've been contemplating to use my free Fantasia to fix my mains nose, but it's actually not that big. And I've had the basic had it basically forever, so I decided not to fund in the end. Yeah, I mean, you do you, right? If something is bothering you, you can change it. Like, who's gonna who's gonna say anything? It's your character, and it's what you want to do, right? I'm not judging. I'm not judging. I do everything for the glam, and I do everything for my character. Sloppy. <laughs> Damn. Uh, check them vibes. Long time no see. Hello. Uh, thank you for the five gifted subs. Thank you, thank you. I appreciate. How are you doing? I have not had you here for a while. Are you good? Thank you so much. I'm welcome in Jay, and it hit like really cool people too. Uh, welcome in Jay, Tar Ninja. Check them vibes. Uh, and not check them vibes. Vad here shield, shield. Sorry, shield. Uh, Blackfire and Wooly. Thank you. Okay, let's try it again. Thank you so much for the five gifted subs. Thank you. Busy, very busy. I can imagine. Uh, I hope you're doing well, though. I hope it's I hope it's a more good kind of busy. You know what I mean? And not a uh, not a totally terrible kind of busy. But yeah, thank you so much, everyone who's here in chat right now and got a sub. Enjoy your emotes. Enjoy your emotes. Thank you so much. Thank you so much, Vibes. I appreciate it. Uh, we're about to do an alliance raid, so we're gonna get into content soon. Now, good busy, but I'm glad to see you have grown quite a bit. Thank you. I, I appreciate it. Uh, you have also helped, and you're... You know. um, so, yeah, thank you. We are, uh, we are doing, we're doing the things. Final Fantasy. Sloppy! So. Zarek gifted a tier 1 sub to check them vibes. Thank you. They have given 153 <laughs> gift subs in the chat. I like how it always reads that out and it calls you out, Zar. Uh, but thank you. Thank you, Zar, for gifting a sub to vibes. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Gifting by not sub. Surprisingly, a lot of a lot of people do that and I don't know. Like, it's so funny to me. But yeah, that is the thing that happens. So yeah, thank you. I appreciate it. I appreciate it. Enjoy your emotes, vibes. Enjoy them. Um, that's more than me. I thought I had that. Yeah, we can keep it that way. It's okay. It's fine. Don't worry about it. Um, but yeah, enjoy your emotes, everyone. Thank you so much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Um, I'm gonna have a talk. Uh, no, you don't get to do that. And you have no power over Brian, which is good. I am the only one that has power over that. Funny enough. Uh, alright, let's try this again, shall we? Ah, uh, now it works. See, Ryuji and his Ryuji and his level one ring. I swear to God. <laughs> um, Blaze would be like, no one one ups me. Please don't. Do not. Do not. Um, but yeah, it is. We, we've been having a great time, Vibes. We've been having a really nice time. And like, Final Fantasy is such a great game, and the community is super nice. And I'm very happy. 
and uh, I'm finally catching up on all the content so we can do that. Um, and like, alliance raids are always good because then you can have more people in a party joining, you know, because it's getting difficult to get everyone in there, but uh, I'm, I'm trying, I'm trying to, to get people into content and then we can do that together. I think it's been working out pretty well, it's just, there's a lot, there's a lot of you, there's a lot of you who want to join. Um, I get so bullied by this pink rock, it's unbelievable. Is that a thing now? What did you call me? Is, is that, is that your nickname for me now? I never once in my life did it and she dirts me this much? What do you mean? Uh, Yuji, I, I'm, I'm mean to everyone. I hope you're aware. It's, don't worry, it's not you, it's me, you know? You know? No, no? Okay. Um, Sekai is suffering from success. I very much am, yeah. Uh, I haven't played Final Fantasy XIV for like six months, so I understand what you mean. Aww. Uh, are you just like, are you like burned out or is it just that you're busy? someone ha can have my spot for p3s oh hell yeah uh p3s is gonna be an experience i think so what we're gonna be doing um for p3s uh is going to be i'm probably gonna make a static for that one uh because i i feel like it would be better to just continue for those with a set group of people and it's still gonna- I'm still gonna be streaming it, and we still can do, like, re-clears with other people, because I would like to just, you know, we can- we can do that. I'm not- I'm not, like, a super litist or whatever, um, when it comes to, like, clearing, and I would like to do it with different people, just like we're doing P1S, uh, on Sunday. So we have cleared P1S, but uh, we have another raid sign up, uh, because I want to clear it with other people, too. There we go. And, um, so yeah, we're gonna go over them, but for, like, first time clears and just, like, generally content in the future, I do want to have a static, so we're, we're gonna be doing that at some point. Um, so yeah, uh, gonna have to see about that, though. I, I have to see about how to handle that. <laughs> so, yeah. Um, but for now we're gonna be- so we're gonna be clearing P2S and then after that we're gonna take a break, uh, for, you know, to get that sorted out. Not like a long break, just like, I- I just wanna get it sorted out. I'm gonna continue with the same people. <gasps> oh shit, what is happening? Sakai body pillow when I want it. At some point I want that. I want- I want merch in general. oh there it is. Oh shit. I want the uh, I want merch in general. But like a body pillow would be so nice. It would be so nice. Sakai is a me is mean to me when I say sorry for dumb reasons. Yeah, oh my god. That is a big statue. Holy shit. Oh, the outfits! Oh, that's so cute! The outfits! Oh god, we need to take a picture after this. We need to take a picture after this. That's amazing. That's just wonderful. Alright, watch me die a million times and you have to suffer. You have to suffer through it. Oh, I like the music. So, you are resolved to face me. Oh, hell yeah. I'm so ready. You should totally make a plushie of your VTuber model, I would buy it. I think that would be really cute. There's a lot of good merch that I can imagine. I feel like a lot of streamers don't have, or like, YouTubers or whatever, don't have a good, don't have good merch. It sounds so weird, right? But I feel like a lot of them just have really weird looking like t-shirts or whatever. Uh, I don't like that. Is there a death zone? I stepped into the death zone and didn't die. What? What? So is there a death zone or? 
I guess I wasn't, I guess my, I guess my, um, my, my little, pin, my little, uh, toe was, was, wasn't, it was in there, but everything else wasn't? Okay, how would we have known to stand there? I don't know. Oh no, actually I do know. Never mind. I do know. Oh my god. Oh my god, what is happening? I'm scared. I don't want to fall off. Does it push it to the side so the this one is gonna be gone? Yes. Okay. That makes a that that makes a lot of sense. Why are we going? Why are we going on there? You're trolling me. You're you're. trust anyone ever um right i was way too slow for that all right there is a huge shield on me and i'm so happy. Uh, oh, hello, pa Packers. Hello, how are you doing? It is first Aglaya. Yes, 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 yes. Um, very quick oh god I'm so dead that, okay they move very quick all right um, but yeah I kind of want them I wonder like we've had this thing right the sake O's, the cereal which I think is a really nice idea what the fuck just happened huh I was about to say, can I not accept the rest now? What is happening? <laughs> Tommy, oh, oh, I'm scared. Oh, I'm scared. I'm just gonna stand here then, I guess. Mega pins, please. Uh, yeah. 
Yeah, I don't need that. But this gear looks so beautiful. Uh, one piece of gear or gear enhancing material obtaining. Okay. Oh, I love this one. I've seen this one. This one is so pretty. Then the destroyer shall take your measure. But I don't need it. After you have provided my servant with some spores. Oh my god. What is happening? Okay. Thank you. It I was looking at the uh, I was looking at the cast name. It said destructive static and I wanted to make a joke, but then I almost died. the song that's playing right now the um the instrumental version of in the balance right uh hello psy um how what i'm not looking at i'm not looking at the i'm not looking at the game My neighbor used to fuck ton of perfume. What? How, why? How would you? How? I, I think there's ghosts in your in your in your home, Ryuji. I think that is ghosts. I don't know if that travels over to you, unless your window is open. Then maybe. But otherwise, I'd be concerned. Uh, I'm in your raid. Where you are? <gasps> Where are you? Where are you? Who are you? Here, I see you. You're the summoner. I have fashioned for our contest. Hello. Hello. That is so funny. That is that is nice. You made out of oh, oh, oh. We're lights. Oh my god. I'm scared. Is this the arena? That is so cool. On the hand too. Oh, it's beautiful. Wonderful. Oh, I think not. Oh my god. Jesus fucking Christ. Wandering star, descend and destroy. Oh, okay. That is so cool. That is such a cool arena. What the heck? Keep a um Oh, I see. Oh my god, that is so cool. Oh, uh, uh, that's scary. That is really cool. That's a really, really scary. <laughs> oh, I should have placed it there. That's fine. We're good. Uh, 
I guess I made it out of Lollardale. I did indeed. Uh, I am finally free. Finally, I can take G poses again, and finally my glams look 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 good again. They look normal again. What? Why are we here? Fine. I'm not gonna ask any questions. You know what? My I'm too brain dead today. I'm too brain dead today to actually question anything. So we're we're fine. We're fine. I don't need to know. That was a that was so cool. The hand that is a really nice. Okay. Come, mortal, <gasps> enter my realm if you dare. Oh yes, please. Excuse me, mommy. Sorry, mommy. Sorry. Oh my god. Oh my god. Should I roll on that? I don't know. should soon mommy and otters yes which one's gonna happen first huh? I can't even pay enough attention to tell that so Markers, it has numbers. I see that now. 
It do be having numbers to tell. I just roll on this, I guess. That looks so cool. That looks so cool. You oh, she's so pretty. By the light of the sun. Just a mirage, or something more. Excuse me, what? That was, yeah. <laughs> I've quite warmed to you. I've only seen this in another fight that I did not need to be reminded of.
gift of flame for our children. Chat, please, I swear to God, uh, if I die, it's your fault. Um, <laughs> welcome in, Cloudy. <gasps> I'm so dead. Um, welcome in, Raiders. Hello. I'm definitely not dying in the new Lions raid right now. Uh, Eclipseon, thank you so much for the for the raid. Welcome in. All my mods are currently in. All my mods are currently in the Alliance raid with me, and I don't want to see a single one of them typing right now. I see you. I'm watching you. Do not. Um. But uh, yeah, welcome in, welcome in, raiders. How was your stream? I hope it was well. This is the first time that I'm doing this raid, so please excuse me if I'm a little quiet because I don't want to die so much. Dar, I swear to God, you're gonna die from. You know what? I don't care. Die from it. Die from it. I don't care. You get no healing from that. Uh, th thank you, thank you for the raid though. I hope your stream was well. I hope you had a good time. What were you doing in your stream? What were you doing? Uh, after this boss is done, we um we can talk a little bit, you know. We can talk a little bit. Um, but hello. <gasps> oh my god. Uh, yeah, this is the first time I'm doing this, so um. Please, I ha hate myself. I hate everything. I should have waited. Um, I should have waited. Um, thank you for the shout out. I debut today as a PNG VTuber. Ooh, how did that go? Oh, it's a song. It's a song. Thank you for the thank you for the follow up sigh and thank you for the follow Cloudy as well. How's this land? To us treasure bestow. Don't know. Don't ask me how I know this song. Desert sands, water and gold below, <laughs> and rubies red. I'm gonna to sing the entire time. Children of man. Oh God. When we reach our ends. To scales we gladly go Our fates are yours to bend Where pales in I don't know the lyrics Her air and sky Want it louder? Rainbow voices lift and high Clonna bags we carry When they back in slide So I don't know the lyrics. That will follow. So high, nascent flame, brighter burn, the souls of fire. Red, gold, spark, rise. After life, everyone just died on me. Please don't. Oh, another one. <laughs> oh, please don't do that again. Um, what is happening? Probably so loud. We weave 
voices lifted high. Quantum X we carry. What do we do? I'm scared. It's actually different. <gasps> Lyrics are hard. I'm scared. <gasps> I was almost saved. Oh god, what is this? I'm gonna die here. <gasps> Find fortune after life. That was not the lyric. But it's fine. I'm so dead. I'm so dead. This is planets all over again. Oh my god. I am so fucking dead. I don't know what's happening, but it's fine. Where are we supposed to be? Oh, we're just oh, they're just they're just DPS goblins. I see. Upon a bag to carry. I love the song. Oh, my God, I'm scared. Still, you can buy our divine authority. Very well, let us continue the objective. We, the traitors, shall weigh your soul! See what's revered, Find fortune after life, for this we pray. We pray. Oh my god, so it's that, uh. It's that mechanic! Look at you! You can beat up your friends! That's so cool! Oh my god! Oh no, this is the one! Oh god, we're all gonna die! Oh, it's gonna be terrible! Oh, this is fine. The moment of judgment is come. It's a quilty weave, rainbow voices lifted high. Dreams, fun facts we carry. The song is really good, and I'm ruining it with my singing, but I don't care. Oh my god, it's so cool.
like that cast as above, so below. It's so loud! What happened there? Jesus Christ. What happened there? <laughs> God, he's not playing tank. Yeah, I saw. Uh, yeah, I. Uh, I don't know what happened there. Uh, that was so cool. I loved that, but it was also way too loud. Look at us! Damn. This was a coordinated attack. That was really cool. That was so cool. That was so cool. And I hate that I didn't get the top. I should have waited. But like, how would I know, right? That's okay. Um, I'm just gonna pass on all of these and do this. Uh, this I don't need. Also, get that. That shit needs to be down. I cannot. I my ears are exploding. We're we're not doing that. I don't know what the background music was on. It was probably on 69. I was probably haha -ha funny and put it on 69. Yeah, we'll put it on 70. Yeah, don't leave. We need to take a picture. Everyone, take a picture. Where do I stand? I'm small. Can I stand here? I'm small. Uh, everyone, reset your pose. Sit down and jump up. Congrats on the first day. Thank you! Again, thank you so much for the raid. I hope, again, let me, okay, let me look through, let me look what I missed. I, am. Um, uh, I, uh, <laughs> I was, I did not have the mental capacity to look at what everyone sent while I was doing this. Uh, mods are typing indeed. They always are. Zar always is. Uh, he tries to be cool, but he just makes me scared. Um... You see why I used to f used to fan that to change my god to her. She's cool. She was really cool. Um, mm, it runs super well, and I could uh, better than I could have imagined. Oh my god, I could have imagined. And well, we just buy the place in Final Fantasy. That is so nice. Some beast tribes. <gasps> How are you liking them? Was it the new ones? Was it the new beast type quests? Um. Because, uh, those are, those are apparently really nice, and you can get, like, cool stuff, right? I mean, you can get a lot of cool stuff from a lot of, um, from a lot of uh, Beast Tribe quests, but I've never really looked into them. I lost an 80 roll on the minion. I hate this game. I hate this game more for not getting the top because I was like, oh, what if I don't get anything, you know? I should have just waited for the top. Mm. Random guy just on the side there. That is, uh, that is Psy. Psy is here. Uh, Psy sniped us. Psy sniped us on purpose. Oh god, now I need to, now I need to, okay, let me do this, uh, then we do this, then we do, this, then Ryuji needs to stop impaling me, like this, now I'm gonna do, Oh, but then it clips into the pizza. I'm so mad. 
I'm so mad. Uh. How do I deal with this? Easy snipe. I mean, I think a lot of people are currently doing it, right? Let me just do this. This is perfect. We're just gonna do that. And then we have Yumi doing that. I never know where to pause this. It looks really good. I like to emote a lot, but I never know where to pause this. This is cool though. Randomly queuing by waiting for my chocobos to breed. Uh, okay. All right. Uh, let's just do that. I need to get the. I'm sorry. I need to get the pet out of here. Um. And then we do this, and then we do that, and then... Mm. I'm still trying to get the tank top. I can imagine it's probably hard to actually get the tops, but I, I think we got really... I mean, I think we got lucky getting two there. I'm not really sure what the drop rates are, but... I'm trying to get a perfect chocobo for for chocobo racing, right? That's you do that in chocobo racing. Man, Ryuji, I swear to God, I'm just gonna make it clip through the pizza. What if I just? What if I just do this? This is better, I guess. Yeah, it was your last emote. Yeah, it always puts your last emote. That's why you sit down for... You sit down and then you jump up to reset your emote. That's what people usually do. But I don't think many people know about... I, I mean, if you're into G-posing at all, you know about that, but... If not, you don't. Ah, uh, that works. And of course, if you take pictures yourself, uh, feel free to share them on the Discord. We did it! I'm happy. I'm very happy. This was cool. This is a cool raid. I just need to use my brain. I just need to use my brain for it. And not have other people do that for me. But, yeah. I think- I think it's not difficult. I don't know. Now I'm just used to- I think I'm just used to worse things now, I guess. Good job, uh, on the clear I'm a fresh PNG tuber and possibly VTuber soon. Aw, oh, good luck with that. Good luck with that. Mm -hmm. I hope that works out for you. Uh, are you doing weekly Ultima on Reels? Uh, that is a good question. Probably not on stream. Um, because this, um, this week we have a lot to do. I, I prob- I will probably do them on Monday before the reset. Uh, so we can do them on Tuesday as well, maybe? I don't know. Um, but I have- I don't have them planned for a stream, but we can probably get something going if people have time on Monday Because, uh, I didn't, like, I didn't plan it this week. The, um, I wanted to do it on Tuesday, right? But then I ended up not streaming and, um, so that kind of- and then I- I, I also didn't do them off stream, but yeah, I, um, we can do that on, like, Monday or I don't know if people have time earlier on I don't know, tomorrow or Sunday, that would also work, but I have nothing planned. There's not gonna be a raid sign up. I'm just gonna ask in uh, FC chat or Link Shell chat whenever people are online. I'm just gonna be like, yo, anyone wanna join for that? And if we get enough people, that's good. And if not, we're just gonna party find the rest and cry together. All right, that's what we're gonna, that's what we're gonna be doing. Um, I miss my Lala Zoomies. I miss my Lala zoomies, but I can still, I can still, I can still zo do zoomies, but now it's like lizard zoomies. Lala, 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 Lala zoomies are so much more funny. They look so much more silly, but yeah. Mm, weekend works better for me. Yeah, the thing is just we have so much going on in the weekend that 
for me, it's just, uh, I don't know, Sunday is probably better for me because tomorrow is just gonna be a double stream and, you know, all of that. I'm gonna see. I I'm leaving, nerds! Last one out is a- is a rotten egg. Mm-hmm. Yep. Yep, yep. And now we do story, and then we're good. Ah, uh, you're safe, thank goodness. Why is Kryl here? I rushed you as soon as I heard the tidings from Raha. Is this true? Beings claiming to be the twelfth have appeared. Yes. So quiet now. You defeated them all, incredible. I had no doubt that you would succeed, but I'm no less impressed for it. Ahaha, <laughs> seldom have I felt such exhilaration. It's my god, hello! Watch, they just want to have fun and fight people and just mess around. I'm getting flashbanged and I do not appreciate it. Same voices for the bosses, so they all they all have the same voice. To think that the day would come that we would we would put on an act for men. I must say, Birgot, you played this villain's role to perfection. Come now, master. I merely did what was necessary to compel the mortals to confront us. Oh, awesome voices. Oh, sorry, I I can't read. Dude, she looks so cool. I've seen her before. Twitter has shown me her. And she looks so cool. Um, still, it pained me to speak to our beloved children so unkindly. So you say, Azema, that you seemed happy enough to... F yet you seemed happy enough to fight them. You did not forget the true purpose of the trial, I hope. Well, I couldn't help but be excited, and do not tell me you felt differently. Consider yourselves fortunate, children. It is rare indeed to see now tale in such high spirits. What in the world is happening? Didn't you say you had defeated them? Did they manage to flee, or perhaps were we summoned? Like, foolish mortals are only at a fraction of our power. Put up your weapons. You have naught to fear from us. Rest assured, we are not summoned beings. We do not drain the land of Aether, nor do we take men into our thrall. But what of the gods who were summoned during the Calamity? The ones Master Luzwa called forth to protect the realm. That was not us, but a primal born of your fervent prayers for salvation. Indeed, that the worst of the calamity was averted and the realm restored in its aftermath is a direct testament to the power of your hopes. Um, if you aren't primals, then what are you? Do you truly intend to really want which is, uh, if you aren't primals, then what are you? Just as men harbor hopes, so too do we gods. To realize our aspirations, tis essential that we do battle with you. Thus did I falsely claim that we sought to rule the world. Was deceitful conduct unworthy of a divinity, and I must apologize, not only for that, but for using my power to do harm besides. These hopes of yours, why won't why won't you tell us what they are? We cannot. If you wish to know the truth, you must discover it for yourselves. It's not easy to move forward when there is seemingly no destination, but if you press on, you will eventually arrive at the answers you seek. 
I, you will understand why we hold our peace, and far more besides. You will learn the very truth of our existence. Go forth, mortals, and seek knowledge of us, and when the time is right, we shall meet again in this place. This is so like out there. <laughs> it's like, okay, yeah, they, these are gods here, fight them. And then they're like, oh yeah, mm, you know. Uh, as if hearing about your battling the 12 weren't shocking enough to have them appear before my very eyes. Suffice it to say, it's been an interesting day. True. But much about them remains shrouded in mystery. At least they seem open to reason. I, in considering our next step, I should very much like to hear your detailed account of them. Right after I have a word with our client, that is. Please give me a moment to introduce myself and then we can review the situation. Yay! Uh, I'm just gonna accept this. And then, uh, and then, and then I'm just gonna call it a day. Uh, a divine dilemma. Cryo wishes to take stock of the situation. Probably gonna be another cutscene. Another long ass cutscene again. Greetings, I'm Kryl of the Students of Baldessian. Do I have the pleasure of addressing Derek, the explorer who sought aid in investigating this place? Monkey! Hi, I am Derek, and this de here is a baby Opo Opo. Aww? Yes, I can see that. Doesn't it have a name? None that I know of, nor would I presume to bestow one, for that would be condescending. I see, that's very considerate of you. It's a monkey, what do you mean? So, I understand you explored the various phantom realms with Derek. Will you recount to me the experience? It was terrifying, I died so many times. So while the gods tested you sorely, you did not sense any malicious intent. As Birgot said, they wish to do battle with us, but it would seem they do not necessarily wish to cause us harm. Though much and more about this perplexus may have to safe to assume that they are not primals. As you may recall, Living Way once told us that the art of summoning, as taught by the Asians, incorporates the fervent desire to assimilate others into one's belief. Thus do the result in primals seek to enthrall worshippers, who in turn seek to grow their ranks. But these beings appear to harbor no such desire. If they are primals, then they are unlike those that have been summoned in recent memory. We might suppose that they were created in antiquity, in like manner to Hydaelyn, but there is no way to prove it. My Twitch is buffering like crazy, I'm sorry. Twitch is sometimes just bad with the connection. <laughs> No. I'm so freaking happy they're another group. Haha, <laughs> we evil, you are beneath dirt and are actually nice entities. They they are not, yeah, they they aren't they aren't like I don't know, they're just so so chill, right? It's like yeah, we actually just wanna chill. Yeah, we're gods, but we just wanna chill, you know. Uh who could they possibly be and why do they desire to battle with men? Flashbang. Stop showing me Emmett, I swear to fucking god, you guys just want to hurt me. Even if you're literally worthy, you know precious little, the true and identities of the twelve, for instance. Yeah, he really said that. He really spoiled the entire fucking thing. Emmett Zack did say that, didn't he? By which we may assume he knew the truth, and challenged you to seek it out too. Suffice it to say, you'll do so, of course. And so far we can ascertain that this is a matter which has implications for the entire star. In light of this, the students of Baldassian formally accept a commission. We will investigate the Phantom Realm and the beings who call themselves the Twelve. I'm pleased to hear that, thank you. Without further ado, I will, then I will take a look around. There are a few things I'm curious about. 
Then with your permission, I will take myself around Eorzea and investigate the worship of these gods we encountered. Sakai, Derek, seeing as you've already seen this place, would you care to accompany me? By all means, in which case... Did you stay here with Kral, my friend? I wouldn't... It wouldn't do to leave a fair maiden alone. Ooh, ooh. <laughs> <laughs> I shall be glad for the company. Take care then, and good luck. Ba -dum, ba -dum. He's going to pop up each time we reach an area. He's spoiled. He, yeah, he probably. They're gonna show. They're gonna show show us Emmett so many times, and then they're, oh, they're gonna show us Hoshafan. They're gonna be like, remember this guy? Remember he fucking died? <laughs> it's gonna be like that every fucking time. They don't. They just don't stop. They just keep going with that. Uh, so, to explain my plan, it is believed that the Twelve were already worshipped during the Third Astral Era when the Elegant Empire flourished. From the Fifth Astral Era, those nations that fought in the War of the Magi each took one of the Twelve as a guardian deity. The pr this practice has continued to the present day in Eorzea with some notable regional differences. For instance, Ishgardians hold Helonia as absolute, while Charlians enjoy a moderate relationship with Taliak. By visiting various locations in Eorzea and learning about the Twelve as they are worshipped, I hope to identify any similarities or differences between them and the beings we encountered. In doing so, I believe we will draw closer to the truth of their identities. For our first destination, I propose we take ourselves to Raga's Reach. The place is holy ground ah, for worshippers of the Destroyer and promises, promises to yield useful details. Oh hell yeah. I'm all for that. That is so cool! Because you also have like a personal, like, because they make you choose a deity, right? And then you have a personal attachment, and that is so cool. Oh, uh, this game is too good. What are we, whatever shall we do? <laughs> oh, it's so great. It's amazing. Uh, I'm just gonna stay here. You know what? I'm just gonna stay with Kryl for. for Cutie, let me hug you. Um, Saka has a neck from mimicking a bobo sound. I just, I did it really well, didn't I? I, I? I did it really well. I made a glam for you, huh? Should I come outside? Do you want to show a, do you want to show a glam? Yeah. They were bored and wanted a friendly bonking. Exactly that, yeah. Um, don't forget to pray your guardian symbol. No, my my guardian doesn't need that. My guardian is a super chad. Um, I can be at the rocks portal. I'm a I'm a leave. I'm a I wanna whatever. I'm I I'm scared. <laughs> I'm scared. There's no unique dialogue or special event where you like team up with your chosen god or something. Am I right? That would be so cool. Imagine. And I, I think they would do that, right? I think they would do that. I like how this is. Just, can I walk? Can I walk over this? No. <gasps> Who's doting? Who dares? Mia. Come here. How are you? Mia. I still like your title. Oh, you're so cute! Oh my god, you're so adorable. I will go into- I will go into- uh, Wait, I'll sit down, actually. I'll sit down next to you, because then we're on the same- Kind of on the same height. Your, is your pose reset? No, you're gonna do it, right? Yeah. Uh, can, can you sit down and reset your pose, and then you can look all cute? Hmm? Um... We can also- we can also just sit down. There's more people doting. I see you guys. Y'all wanna be in a- you all wanna be in a picture, huh? You all wanna be in a picture? Come on, I know you do. Come on, get- get- get in- get- get- get in here. We're taking a G-pose. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
Just remember to reset your pose. <laughs> That's so cute. Look at this is a nice spot. Oh, this is gonna be so nice. It's gonna be really nice. Yep, this is cool. Uh, let me just get rid of. Let me just get rid of. Uh, uh. It's so. Why is it so quiet here? Why is there no music here? Hello? Um, we do... I guess this one, maybe? I can't do my duty complete thing, so sad. I guess that one works. Get the grass out of here, I swear. We're all looking- okay, we're all looking and we're all looking- I don't know where we're looking. <laughs> we look like you've come to the wrong neighborhood. That is what we look like. It's like, oh, you want to mess with this gang? Yeah, like... <laughs> you better- you better don't. Can we just like all look up somewhere? Yeah, this is cool. <gasps> this is cool. Okay, wait, I need to adjust the thing, you know. This is a G post stream, by the way. This is not. We have no content. We just do. It. We just do G poses, and we all hang out. That is what we do. There's no content here. If you think I do anything other than this all day anyway, you are wrong. This is what I do all the time. Let me do this. Take one without. And. I like the crystal tower in the background. But I don't think I can make that work because I um if you if you ever need advice for G pose, if you want a realistic proportions for a character, just put it at 200%. Put the first one at 200% and it's going to make your like it's going to have realistic proportion proportions and then putting it further away is like you have a more cinematic kind of effect. So I always put it at 200 when I take pictures because that is the and it's more you know it's more um it looks more uh i don't know it's just it, the proportions are better it's not like a cinematic shot it's not supposed to be one right it's just supposed to be a uh this is cool it's just supposed to be a um group picture you know uh Why is the music gone? I feel so awkward. Alright, sing a song for me. I feel awkward without music. <laughs> Alright, enough. We're good. Where's my music? Please don't die. <laughs> Stop. Um. Is there never mu- No, there is music here, but just when it's day, right? Or something. I don't know how it works. I know- I know there is music here for a fact, but I guess not right now. Um... But yeah, I think that was it for today. Let me just, uh, wait, let me just, uh... Do this, and then we're good. Uh, thank you so much for joining today. That was really cool. Uh, I will try to get the healer top another time. I have failed very much, but that is okay. Um... I will uh, be back tomorrow. I have to end stream. It's already... Oh, God. It's already 1 a.m. Um, <laughs> we're going to be back later. No, not later. Well, yes, later, technically. Uh, we're going to be back with some Bloodborne. And then we're going to be back with Coils tomorrow. So if you're interested in seeing minimum item level Coils, uh, that is what we're doing tomorrow. Uh, and, um, yeah, and also Bloodborne because I hate myself. Uh, so, yeah. Uh, thank you so much for joining today. We will also continue main story quest next week. Uh, and um, on Sunday is going to be... Uh, Sunday is going to be P1S and P2S. Uh, depending on... I don't know. We're going to see. It's probably only... It's going to be a reclear of P1S. And I hope we can clear it. Depending on like how many people are new or are not familiar with the... Um, 
with the uh, mechanics, it's obviously going to take longer. And I have planned two hours for P1S and then two hours for P2S. But we're going to see. Uh, it is a little scuffed this week, I think, because I want to do these like in, in succession. And it's probably going to be different people signing up for it. But that is okay. And if you'd like to sign up for our raids, uh, I can highly recommend joining the Discord. Because that is where we do... Uh, we do our raid signups uh, for, for random stuff, and um, we also have a lot of channels, and we have a waifu bot, and uh, we do all kinds of things together. So yeah, um, thank you so much for joining. I shall, uh, I shall see who's online right now to send you over to uh, on Twitch, but if you want to do a, if you want to send us over to a uh, streamer of your choice, uh, don't forget that there's a channel point redeem where you can um what's happening here where you can uh mm, uh t uh you know j send us over to someone and then we're gonna go there and then it's gonna be great so yeah <laughs> and uh if not i'm just gonna look for someone and look at what they're doing um oh my god i think i know where i want to go i think i know where i want to go let us see, unless we have someone doing the redeem. Huh? What is up? Anyone has a redeem? No? Okay, then I'm sending you over to... Oh! Um, that is not the right command. Um, that should be the right command? Yes! I'm um, sending you over to Kogon, uh, is, uh, is a Final Fantasy XIV creator, uh, who's also, who also does the YouTube videos. You've probably seen him, you've probably seen him on Twitter or on YouTube. Uh, and uh, he also streams on Twitch. So yeah, uh, thank you so much for joining today. We're going over. Uh, he is doing a housing tour on Primal uh, plus the Unreal and Mount Farm. So he's going to be doing one of these things or all of them, I guess. Um, and he just started streaming 15 minutes ago. Also, Tatsuya Kurosawa, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome in. Welcome in. Um, so yeah, thank you for hanging out with me today. Again, we'll be back tomorrow and on Sunday. Um, don't forget to go to the socials. Thank you, Stream Elements, uh, if you're interested in, you know, being part of the community. Um, so yeah, what is happening? Uh... Should have done Lulu got partner today. Did Lulu Lulu got affiliate? No, did Lulu get partner already? I thought I saw something about uh about affiliate, but that would be insane. That would be insane. Uh, but yeah, Lulu's also streaming. I see that. But I always go for like less viewers. <laughs> Funny enough, uh, and Ko just started streaming. So yeah. But, uh, yeah, thank you so much, um, and, uh, I will be, uh, there tomorrow, and you stay safe out there, stay hydrated, everything, and, uh, have a good one, everyone. Bye-bye!